Chap. Hey, a nigga going off the bitcoins. Sad for like fuck if you ain't on. Twenty-eight hundred pockets is the time zone. You can even see the history of my flight plans. Think you wanna talk big, but I built it. Who can build it? It's Sunday, y'all know what time it is. Who can build it? Sunday, y'all know what time it is. We be rolling royalty in the golden house. While I still get it popping in the trade house. Trade house. Right now in the comment section, let me know where you from. If you know the verse of the song or the chorus, sing that shit. Right now in the comment section, let me know what you ate for breakfast. Turn up, what's up? If you never been to the stream, then you already know what the fuck it is. It's your boy time. Let's get it, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. Hey, defense, you know what that defense is. the pain like 40 for the frequent. Need that double up, pop it for the seat. What I need you to do right now is comment your favorite pair. That's right, your favorite pair. We live in five right now, baby. This Sunday, we going to fuck up. Let's go. What I need you to do right now, if you haven't done it already, is share that feed, share the feed, share the feed, share the feed. Let's get it. Oh, move it in the 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 the energy could never be duplicated. The energy could never be duplicated. The energy is contagious. Turn the fuck up. Let's get it. Alright man, if y'all don't know that I was going off Bitcoin, if y'all don't know that I was going off Bitcoin, make sure you smash that like button and anybody who dislikes it, whoop they motherfucking ass. Let's get it though. So yo, SPX5, SPX5. Now, a lot of you guys know about SPX5. Some of you guys are trading the standard in Port 500 and you, you actually like it. You know what I mean? Um, it shows a very slow, steady gain. I feel like this is like the snail of indexes, you know what I mean? like. If there was a snail index, like this would be it right here, just slow and steady. I mean, straight to the point, if it's a bull run, it's a bull run. If it's a bearish, you know what I'm saying, market, then it's a bearish market. But currently, we're in a bullish market. So I mean, a lot of people, um, I don't know if, uh, who's looking for short opportunities. Now, I know my intraday scalpers would definitely, you know, try to come through and look for shorting opportunities, but this is a buyer's market right now. It's a bullish market. And I feel like price and, um, and the market will continue to hold. It will continue to grow. Okay, and we can do it like that. So I don't know who follows me on Twitch. I don't know who follows me on Twitch, right? I don't know who follows me on Twitch, but we talk about the entry for noobs and I gave you guys the entry for noobs. That was back at like 3,300 or some shit. What was that? 33, 33, 37 or something like that. So 33, 37, that's where the uh, entry for noobs were. And uh, I mean, it was an opportunity for, for noobs. And what noobs are is new people, newbies who are new to this whole environment, new to the whole get down, new to the whole uh, stream and stuff like that. You feel me? So I just like to keep you guys on track. I mean, but we've literally been on this same trend for months. So I mean, shit, you literally should just been following along every single week, watching everything play out. Okay, so you probably wonder like, yo, what uh, what time frame am I on? So 
this is what pair I'm on, or not pair, but this is the chart I'm on. This index is um, SPF, uh, SPX 500 or Standard & Poor's 500. I'm on the four hour time frame. And now they, what, what time frame, Ty? Can, can you please give me the time frame, Ty? Can you please give me the time frame, Ty? And I'm like, man, I'm giving you goddamn time frame, eh? So it's for our time frame, you know what I mean? Let's get it. Make sure you guys share that joint. Make sure you guys share that joint too. Make sure you guys share that joint. What's popping? What's popping? I know we got started a little bit late today. Um, shit, we had a crazy ass night last night, bro. With me, it was fucking lit, yo. Going up on YouTube right now, live. Fucking Trey Gang lit. I'm tweeting this out. Trey Gang litty. Right now, y'all got that energy this morning. I can feel the energy through the screen. Like, I can feel, I mean, through the screen, through the stream, you know what I mean? So, I'm getting back to it. I just, I'm writing on uh, Twitter right now, you know what I mean? Let's get it. But yeah, we just talk about the long term. Um, I mean, and can you continue to hold? So, you're supposed to let the winners run, let the winners run. Long term, we can continue to hold. I got people who are swing trading with me and who, I mean, actually love, you know, who love the uh, the idea of it and who love the the powers of compounding your account over time, gains over, uh, gains over, gains over time equal gains over years. You know what I mean? So, like I said, man, it, it is, uh, there is some scalpers, you know, there is some day traders, some intraday people, but, yo, know, gains over time equal gains over years every single time. You feel me? So, SPX5 does make drastic moves, just slow and steady, like a snail. So, we call this the snail market, you know? What type of market are we in? We in a snail market. This motherfucker moves slow. So, um, for the week. Well, I definitely feel like the weeks will continue being bullish. Um, slight pullback right now. Friday gave us, like the end of Friday gave us a little pullback. It could pull back one more time to this area right here. I'm gonna go ahead and expand this out. All right, that's 3325, so we can come down. It's a possibility, you already know the retest. I mean, what goes up must come down. It's a little bit of divergence right here. So if it doesn't break this little area right here, then for sure, for sure, we're definitely gonna come down, retest, okay? Get in line with the whole trend, all right? retest boom and then you already know what comes after that boom goes up makes a new high retest goes up makes a new high retest goes up makes a new high so you know what i mean and that's the and that's the game so if you're patient enough you know to uh shit get in and buy at a great price then you'll be able to ride with this you know what i mean but or like i said you have your intro traders who will try to scalp that on down i mean and it's possible like i said i mean you know how the markets work it's not like you're just gonna well to be honest, shit, the way these markets been going, this motherfucker will gap up on you one time for the one time. You be like, okay, well, it's just gonna keep gapping on a Sunday and just run, you know what I mean? So, um, this definitely been an interesting market, you know what I mean? You said there should be a wave of Australian dollar against the yen on Friday. BHP Billiton um, of Australia intends to reach a strategic cooperation with the Soft Bank of Japan. It's a big market opportunity. See, that's why I like the stream too, because you guys get on here dropping, you know, dropping knowledge and stuff. We get the, we get the, uh, we get talking. We really get the, you know, get get shit cracking and stuff like that. If you guys like that, uh, like that last song, that was actually. Uh, that was produced by the real young X, you feel me? And then uh, you already know I had Rob Legacy on the engineer, you feel me? And then I had somebody else. You guys probably see him inside of the uh, inside of the Discord, but that was Sin who did the uh, the artwork for me, you feel me? So Sin on Insta, Sin on Forex, bro, be doing this thing, man. And you guys probably see him on the stream too. So you know the thing is like we shout out all the all the people who really you know it's like it's like a team effort. So everything you see, like at first I was you know what I'm saying solo doing it by myself, but then it just we start building, you know what I'm saying? And now it's just it's expanding like crazy if people what's the big cream shirt it's the big cream so it's that big cream you know what i'm saying i got that shit smacking with the with the joint trade I mean, we got hella shit dropping you know what i mean so hella shit dropping hella shit dropping hella shit dropping so this is standard and pores what i feel about this is not about what i feel it's about what i see and i see market needs to pull back to give new buyers a price to continue to get in and continue buying and continue holding this uh this bullish trend this bullish trend we got you got a fucking president who's going to continue touting the 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 bulls and what's cool about this is as nasdaq continues to reach new highs every single week which we'll go over to nasdaq you know what i'm saying let me go ahead and go ahead and run that nasdaq sound effect real quick Cause you know that should be, you know that should be moving. You know what I'm saying. So you know that Nasdaq joint be be clicking. You know what I'm saying. So we are gonna get it like that. So we gonna go over to Nasdaq in a second. But if you wanna know where I'm at with the SPX, like we definitely need to come down for, for new buyers to get in. Or you have to wait. If it breaks over the top, then you just gotta keep buying with it. And that's just what it is. You're gonna take a little bit of drawdown. It's gonna up and down because that's the motherfucking market it's like a booty club you feel me but it's gonna be able to keep moving you know what i'm saying like taco bell after you eat it through your system <laughs> let's get it 
<laughs> Let's get it. <laughs> Let's get it. Nah, we definitely need more. Uh, we definitely need more more likes. We definitely need more likes. So right now, if you can hear the sound of my voice, if you can hear the sound of my voice, smash that like button. If you can hear the sound of my voice, smash that like button. You feel me? Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. You say, how you guys doing? What's going on, everybody? What's going on? And then I need chat talking to each other, too. You already know this is the best place to network, communicate. You know what I'm saying? So chat, talk to each other, too. Chat, talk to each other, too. Let's get it. But we already about to get over to that NASDAQ, man. So let's get over on to that NASDAQ. And uh, we're going to start it up. So I'm going to go ahead and go ahead and bang that jam. You know what I'm saying? Because we, we definitely do got that NASDAQ, NASDAQ. Smoking on that gas pack. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So let's go ahead and load that up, yeah, dig. And then also, you know, we had that Forex Trader Challenge. I don't know who's completed that. Um, I don't know who's completed that, but uh, yeah, we definitely talk about more of that as well. And then how you guys like the uh, how you guys like the thumbnail for today? You know, I was able to get the skull with the Meta Trader on it. Got the Forex course and it's in the trash because them shits is trash. You feel me? Let's get it though. Let's keep let's keep going in. And then you know, also we got the. Uh, you also got the uh, the Twitch, you feel me? So I feel like most people, I know you feel like you'll get more information watching the Forex, but to be honest, you'll get more information um, in game watching the Fortnite or me play video games because I'm really in my element. Like, as you guys know, I hate looking at these charts. You know what I'm saying? I hate looking at these charts, man. You know, I hate that shit, but I mean, I can play the video games and talk Forex all day. We can chop it up. We can talk about, yo, where were you going wrong? Where were you going right? Like, it's a chance to let people come on and we can all really just communicate as a community. So I feel like it's pretty dope. You know what I mean? I'm about to bang that NASDAQ, NASDAQ, smoking on that ass crack real quick. You feel me? And uh, we're going to get it cracking like that. You dig, you dig. Oh, also that Forex trade music video is coming soon too man at forest trader music video is coming soon too and i see you guys running up my streams mean code is almost at 13,000 streams i'm gonna show you guys look at that you got mean code almost at 13k you feel me so look at that man look at that man look at that y'all running that shit up though y'all running that shit up though let's keep it going man let's keep running that up with the audience i got though no cap y'all should have this shit at 100 at 100 thou you feel me i'll drop shit two damn near two terabytes of free forest courses you run up one of these songs to 100 thou no cap I see when I come over here and I see one of these songs at 100 plus thou or 100 thou, I'm like, easy call. Nigga, I'll drop all the first courses. Fuck you. He did say he, we'll drop, he'll drop first courses if we get the streams to 100,000? Oh, shit. I'm about to go subscribe to the page right now. Hey, Ty, can you show me what the link is, man? I'm going to go over here and look up the link. You literally just type in Tyler man, and that's how you do it, man. And that's how, you know, you get it cracking like that. You feel me? But we about to go ahead and bang that NAS 100 as we move to NAS 100. Get it! Hey, somebody donated the Super Chat. I bought a course for 400. I've been putting $40 a week into my account, still learning every day. Dang, that sucks you got the course, but I'm going to tell you the truth. Look. You're going to be able to make it to the next level. I'm going to get you on track. You know what I'm saying? You're going to be able to recoup that, that quick four and uh, be able to turn that four into more. You know what I'm saying? And then also make sure you get on my email list too. You want to get on the email list. You want to get on the email list as well. So you want to go to tradegang.com and get on that email list. It's a lot of fire info coming out. So, uh, yeah. Hey, yo, Kizzy, what the fuck? What the fuck? Man, shit, bro. Keep sending these tracks through. Cool, swerving through the lane on 26. Hey, yo, big, sure. big, bust some land, make a big flip. You in them currency, just a little tip. That's 100, that's some big shit. I need y'all to turn over with me right now. You in profits, had to double flip. So shit, pound versus the dollar on the back end. If you vibing out, turn the fuck up right now. Go ahead and smash that like button. Let's get it. Learn to record the facts in. Then we package up the Gouda Muda packs in. Okay, now slice the cheese up, buy the land with it. Withdraw it. Then you send with you. That's right, that's okay, right. get it out the mud with rubber bands and work the plans. Leave it up to ops and then fuck your other hand. Straight up. Keep your eyes open and keep, keep your, your eyes on your sand. Ground, Time right. always moving, so, so you better keep the fan. Yeah. Always check the eyes and they posture and they stance. Creeping through the lane in the road, ain't okay. no plane, ain't no song. Now, as we get in the NASDAQ, I'ma let this song bang. But look, if you were on the Twitch, then I mean, really, to just read what was there. It'll talk about the previous stream, it'll talk about all that, man. So we'll go into that. I'ma let this motherfucking song play. I'm looking at it on the four hour, and then we're gonna go up to higher time frames. Let's get it. Sing it, man. NASDAQ, NASDAQ, smoking on that gas pack. Pass that, set it, attack that. Hey, hey, fill up the tank, amass that. Bitch, 
Run up the boat, that's a big fat ass on Sundays, baby. That, smoking on that gas pack. <laughs> well, we vibe. That, it, this the motherfucking vibe. Hey, hey, this the vibe they like. Tank. This I'm that ass. one time shit they like. Bitch. Run up the boat, back. I wake up, life is different, and I see the views. Who's different? Lambo hitting different This that motherfucking sauce right here. Rory sitting all black, it's a different This that shit people wanna copy. They try to copy and paste this sauce, baby. We should can't copy and paste this sauce, baby. No. Start the engine, drop the top, and, and I'm, I'm on the road. road. Oh, like the tip of the J while I'm on the go. Okay. Close a trade and move the point to the honor roll. Better trade out here bustin' like an act. 47 trades up, and I'm a blast. Black Air Force Ones and Black Max. What's up? I'm in my all black. And if you really be off that gas pack, put the motherfucking fire emoji. What's up? That gas pack. Pass that. Set it. Attack that. Fill up the tank. I'm past that. Oh shit. One up the boat. That's a big pack. Nas that. Nas that. Smoking on that gas pack. Pass that. Set it. Attack that. Fill up the tank. I'm mass. Bitch. Run up the boat. Back. All right, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. That was that Nasdaq joint. That was that Nasdaq joint, and we're going to move a little bit faster now. I just really wanted to get that out. I got that energy right now, so I didn't smoke some of that gas packing. I really got that energy right now, you know what I mean? So, shit, we just going to turn up. But Trey Gang is definitely going to fuck up right now, man. Trey Gang is lit right now. Um, man, we building all over. We building all over. We building all over. You feel me? We're going to make that shit. We're going to make that shit pop. You feel me? And uh, yeah, but shout out to everybody, man. I know niggas stay on the bullshit, but we gonna, we gonna keep making that happen. You know what I'm saying? We gonna keep making that happen. Twitch is going up. Shit, uh, I'm about to post on Instagram, but look, so on the previous stream, right? NASDAQ was just leaving a new buying zone. And I was like, for those who got in, welcome to the train. So every single day on Twitch, I'm live on Twitch from, uh, from eight to 10 every single morning. You know what I'm saying? I'll go ahead and live on Twitch from 8 a.m., 10 a.m., PST, every morning. What's my Twitch? Twitch.tv slash Tyillionaire. I spelled that wrong as fuck. Damn, nigga, you can't spell your own name. <laughs> All right, let's get it. All right, so, boom. So this is this how you follow alone. If you want to know like how to get with the market, this is how you follow alone right here. You feel me? So we spoke about it in a previous stream. So this is just the four hour chart. All right, so as I zoom in, right? Really, I haven't even fucked with this at all, but look how market structure just played on out. Hit every single zone perfectly, okay? And really, to be honest, that's literally what it is. Like this market is so simple. Um, you just kind of got to let everything play out. So now here we are again at our zone, okay? So the thing is, I am definitely expecting a possible push to the downside before we get another push to the upside because that's the nature of the market that's the nature of the motherfucking ocean and if that's just how it goes that's just how it goes um well you want to ask why well i'll explain really quick so like I, the reason i always do the the lengthy explanations in the beginning is just because like i said i try to get the people who are new here on track you know what i mean you said where do i get the trade game course oh yeah tradegame.com um just go on the website and search up trade game courses on there you feel me but we definitely got the free course. Um, we put out a fuck, what was it, 70 plus page, you feel me? So shout out to Big Joint for that. Shout out to Big Joint for that. Like I said, like, Trey Gang Big, you feel me? We really got, we, it's, it's really it's really big and we really growing. Like, I feel like we got, we got members in every city, you know what I'm saying? So it's crazy. What up, what up, what up, what up, what up, what up? All things pop, what's the deal? It looks like a trend, it's on this trend line from the last highs, yeah. But we got two weeks right here and that weeks wicks all right so with these two wicks basically symbolize i know they're red they're like hammers right it's like price shot up to the top well it's really price shot is shot up a little bit and then shot down to the downside okay shot back up one more time and then kind of closed bearish so that means it closed on its way down you know what i'm saying yo chucky luciano what's the deal man appreciate that man appreciate that let's get it let's get it let's get it Let's get it. Hey, join the Discord and drop your food rule. Join the Discord, drop your food rule. Join the Discord, it's better than Google. <laughs> Let's get it. Nah, hey, ATL members need to link up. No kizzy, no kizzy. Let's get it. Make sure y'all, uh, make sure you guys start tapping in with each other, man. Make sure you guys start tapping in with each other. So I definitely feel like we're still on that second leg. NASDAQ has hit its highs, but as you know, the retracement must come so new buyers can get in. That's just the nature of the market. Whoever designed the game designed it real nice, just like that. You know what I mean? So you will have the scalpers who try to come in. Will we get down to this 10-9 area again, 10-8 area? It's a very strong possibility just because of how NASDAQ and uh, has been moving these past few days. It's been literally in this nice little range. So when I go to a higher time frame, we can go ahead and delete this, some of this off of here. I'm gonna put it back. 
I'm gonna go to a higher time frame, go to like the daily, right? And that's what you see on the day. So in a sense, like you, why do I like my charts small like this? Cause I like to see the trends and where it's going. All that other shit to me is noise. Like a lot of you wanna read all the little intraday shit, but I'm reading the future, nigga. Like, where is this going? Oh, to the upside, for sure. Is it gonna keep making gains? It looked like it. If the company's been performing well, uh, and this is their fucking history, like if we looked at the history just in the 2020 history, like this is, you know, where the company really start gaining that and that motherfucker has not slowed down. You feel me? <laughs> motherfucking, this is the motherfucking blunt pattern. So right now we've actually found the joint pattern. Okay, so in the joint pattern, what you do is you know that the motherfucking shit gonna get high, baby. <laughs> Let's get it. You said do a currency pair. I wanted to do the big shit first. You know what I'm saying? I wanted to do the big shit first because uh, you know what it is. You know, but nah. And so he's like, bam, bro, Titan found the actual joint pattern. Like, let me see the joint pattern, bro. What do you mean the market's going to keep going high? Yeah, let's get it cracking. But nah, so it's just like this. You know, you found it. Imagine the company, boom, you get in here, just continue to doing well, and it should continue doing well for the next few years. I mean, that's what it looks like, you know. It doesn't look like it's had any re horrible gains except, you know, this part right here, which is the whole corona shit. And that was when that happened. But, I mean, outside of that, like, we're, we got pretty good structure, and we're going to, you know, keep moving to the upside. You feel me? So now, where to get another entry at? All right, so like I said, I feel like we have to be bearish before we're a big bullish again. But I mean, I don't control the market, so it's nobody to say that this shit won't just gap up. Um, it just won't gap up, you know, and continue bullish. Just, I mean, it's a bull trend. Like, yes, we expect the pullback. I mean, because you trade Forex, you trade, you know what I'm saying? You trade Forex and, you know, get it cracking. You know what I'm saying? But you, 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 uh, you expect the pullback because that's the nature of the market. You know what I mean? Let's get it. Y'all turning the fuck up, man. That's what I'm saying. I really rock with y'all. But let's move to that US 30. You feel me? I see a lot of people hitting the, uh, the, the trade gang shit for the, for the courses. Make sure y'all get some other shit other than courses too. You feel me? Process is gonna be a minute, but we got y'all. We got y'all. I know I'm getting a lot of orders, but I got y'all. We getting everything out. You feel me? And I'm hiring more people to the squad too. So I'm out here just building. You know what I'm saying? Just making sure everything gets to y'all. We about to, you know, just keep building, keep getting shit out. Like I said, this is the big cream joint. Should be smacking. You feel me? So way to wear that shit. Boom. So, you know. But yeah, man, TreyGang.com, feel me, TreyGang.com. I'm gonna drop money on waves in a second. I'll drop that joint in a second, I got you. Now this was produced by Rob Legacy, you know what I'm saying, I, I shout out all the producers. The first one is, hey yo, Kizzy, what the fuck? So that was Kizzy on the uh, on a NASDAQ, NASDAQ, smoking on that gas pack, you feel me? And then, uh, but that's had 5,000 views on the, on the music channel too. We need to get all those up, like I said, we'll give you hella free courses. You get any of my songs to 100,000. It's, it's 800 people here right now. You niggas can motherfucking, no cap, right? No cap, y'all can be on here, right? Press and just play every time you wake up in the morning, just press and play and get it cracking, you know? So let's get it like that. I'm gonna let that money on waves drop and then we're gonna move to US 30. And then after I get from uh, US 30, we'll go to all the other markets and we're gonna hit those markets much faster. But the reason I really want to break down the indexes and all of that is because you know, these are like market leaders. So it's just, it's much easier. And then after after this, before I go to currencies, I'll go to gold and then uh, we're gonna just, you know, get through that shit, you know what I'm saying? So we're gonna make that just happen. Let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. Shout out to y'all on Facebook too. I see we got people over on Facebook too. So let's get it over on Facebook too. Make sure you smash that like button. Whatever you do, make sure you smash that like button. Let's get it. I'm about to play that money on waves. <clears throat> Well, really, we about to do US 30, so I'm gonna play US 30. So I'll play a little bit of money on ways and then I'll switch it to US 30. Trade gang shit go tempo. Trade gang shit go tempo. Trade gang shit on tempo. Yeah. Big team up, big time. I trade, yeah, I get it. Uh. This will probably be a song Without a hook, you gotta suck every word in Like a book, better yet said it in Feel like you want no roof, ayy Money like a Saturday, commas inside the room And karma never miss, so you better grab a broom Clean that shit up or you go through the looms Go through that shit like it's nothing to lose Understand life will just give you a mirror that you be protected Ooh, Do everything to protect all your views Freedom is rare, so do as you choose But every choice always comes with a noose Addicted to something, addicted to sorrow Or skip it today cause you live for tomorrow Addicted to money, but stick to my balls. Yeah. Stick to my lane and I stay on my toes. Trade ain't shit, yeah, I trade with my woes. Fair through the needle, I see through the lows. Still eat the oodles and still in my roots. Walking that way, so be walking a line. This 
Just when we coopin' that feeling inside Make the pump, just turn on the road Overflowin', so turn up the vibe Turn up the basement and slow to the fine Smash the whole ceiling, then open the vibe Songs will change life if you let them, you bright Hear this shit changing your Let energy, changing your synergy I know you feelin' me, boppin' your head Cause you feelin' the interlink Link to your conscience, I'm locked to the markets I'm locked to the pockets, I said it, I'm done it Money go line when the bell ring is thunder Me in the trenches, got scalpers and runners Talkin' that shit, that shit, but we movin' Run that shit up, Robbie. Get that shit, run that shit back. Try Let's to get it, it, then I run up the pack. Mask up, then we load up the jack. Mask up. Get that shit, run that shit back. Try to get, then we run up turn the up, pack. Turn up, turn up, turn up. Mask up, then run I run up the pack. Chat, let me know. Mask up, Robbie, mask up, fuck up. Clap. Big dog, rich dog, been a rich dog since a kid dog. Even when I was broke, I couldn't fall. Stay ten toes to my grind, I best at ten fold. Move a ten to two thousand in the morning, all gold. If I'm greedy, kick US thirty to my count, get locked, y'all. Easy money and I'm gone, toss the phone, need a zone. Big booty freak when I suck because I'm free. Big booty freak when I suck because I'm him. Trade niggas, banks on taps like museums. Flip your per diem and triple up the profit, serve the trades like Tim's. Black Tim's, that's put on the gas of this yacht from Long Beach. Drove everything down the block from Rari's to Lambos to Rose and Drop Tops. We don't see them around the city, what they say the day around. Right, hey, I'm in the trade right now. What's the hype? Hey, shot call of shit, so you know it's trade to die. They say the trade game, but are you really going Let's get it popping. Let's get it popping. We'll bang the rest of that later. But check this out. Yo, so when we go into the four hour, right, the strong supply zone is like a supply and demand zone. It basically has to break through. So I don't know if you follow me on Twitch or not, but if you don't, I mean, shit, like you definitely want to get over there. That's that's where it's at for sure, for sure. So I said, Forrest is a scam. Okay. Who gives a fuck? But look, I'm about to go ahead and uh, go ahead. Yo, tap in, tap in, tap in, tap in. We going to fuck up right now, man. YouTube is really live right now. The energy, we just vibing. So make sure you guys get over to the YouTube right now. Smash that motherfucking link in my bio, bitch. What's happening? Yo, tap in, tap in, tap in, tap in. We going to fuck up right now, man. YouTube is really live. Right you feel me? YouTube going up. Turn that shit up. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. All right. So we about to go ahead and go uh, look closer in there. So I was like, we will start by looking at the four hour. We can go higher or lower, but it's a nice bullish channel and, and prices in consolidation. Uh, consolidation. So this is the bullish channel I'm speaking about right here. Okay. You see that there's just a healthy bullish channel. This channel has been going, I mean, really from March 20, March 2020, you know what I'm saying? So from March 2020 until now, as we've been on a nice, healthy trend, um, what is now? August, you feel me? So March, April, May, June, July, we are six months, six months healthy trend. So for the past six months, the uh, past two quarters, the markets have been performing well, you know, so we definitely can expect this next trimester, you know, to, to uh, to, to continue spitting out those gains. It doesn't look like we're slowing down anytime soon. It doesn't look like we're slowing down anytime soon in the index. And um, you see gold futures pushing to the top side as well. Uh, it's a lot of interesting things going in, on in the market right now. Investors are just trying to lock in and really, you know, make everything crack and uh, get that bread. All right. So when we scroll down into the four hour, you probably like, oh, I want to get a position. So this is where you're at right now. All right. And in this little zone, Basically, you just got fucking your little supply zone and your demand zone. Or, I mean, support, you can call this support or resistance. I mean, it's a thousand ways to, to do it. I know you, oh man, bro, I'm trying to hear that shit. And then, you know, some people, they want to look at the divergence and then the confluences and then throw seven Fibonacci's on top of the shit. Just confuse the fuck out of yourself. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, my little trend lines will be healthy. I don't have to worry about nobody doing nothing. You know what I'm saying? Cause this shit just, it just stay like, it just stay and it just hit like that. Super simple Forex, no extra confusion. And I'm telling you the truth, nigga, you come to trade game, you can eat for free, nigga. Fuck all that bullshit. You wanna test, you wanna test? You want to test if your mentor on that BS or not? Come to Trade Gang, right? Come to Trade Gang, join the Discord, join the Discord for free, and see if you eat. You feel me? Fuck what it's like that. It was really good. I stand behind my product. For sure, for sure. I know, I know for a fact, you feel me? I know for a fact you're going to be able to eat. You feel me? I think that's why people are here fucking with us now. 
Because we eat, baby. We eat, baby. But look, so basically we're in a strong supply and demand zone. The supply is at the top. Once again, demand is at the bottom. We just basically sitting here waiting for it to break through. The supply zone has to break through so we can keep getting those pushes to the upside where your uh, where your zone is at, where we're looking to exit is around that 29, uh, 29 thou area right now. Price is at 27, what is this? 27,885. You feel me? It's, it got close into the 28 thou, but I mean, we still have to break through that full 28 thou, which is like right here. So the high that we got to is 28.1 that's the highest high currently in this low trend until we break out of that so what do i expect market to do well since we have more weeks being rejected to the top side okay more weeks being rejected to the top side i definitely see that people are holding that price at that top side because there's more weeks literally being rejected that's like it got a fucking we got a line of centers and anybody you send through niggas is just swatting the ball like bro you're not getting through the wall bro you're not getting through the wall you know what i'm saying we built a wall of centers a line of centers like you're not getting through no matter what so that's basically what's happening um right here so that's why this is a very strong supply zone that's why i was like it's a strong supply zone and it has to push okay it has to break through to push push on the way so hits it gets rejected it hits it not saying that it's not it's look at market it keeps trying to go in the same place so we know once it breaks through it's gonna be a great time to get cracking and get on because that, that's that that's that number when it's time to, to move now you never really necessarily want to buy when the price is that high you feel me because like i mean you're looking at it like it's a high ass price you definitely want that jet to come down a little bit lower so we can make it happen you feel me so let's get it man but shout out to all y'all man if you haven't already we need you to smash that like button how many likes do we have right now uh, how many likes right now? Um, how many likes do we have right now? How many likes do we have right now? Let me know. Let me know. Let me know. You feel me? How many likes do we have right now? Let's get that shit cracking. We need to get them likes up. All right. So that's us thirty. Um, we can look at this on a on a higher time frame if you want. But I already showed you when I shrunk the market down like this. Oh shit. All right. When I shrunk the market down like this, right? And then I went back to here. This was well, shit. This April, but we already looked back and we were like in March. Here's March 20 right here. You feel me? That's when the gains really start turning around. So like the end of March, that's when the market started to reverse. It started to get that that uh, that first little line of recovery, and really it's been on the up and up ever since. Now you you think when the price comes down a little bit, you think that's a down market and you get afraid. But you got to understand, price doesn't just shoot up like this. That's not how it works. The market trends this way. You know what I mean? So it's like, it's the staircase on the way up. Like a lot of you niggas, and I feel like this is the best example, right? This is the best example of success right here. So a lot of people, you guys want the fucking arrow. You know what I'm saying? You think success is just, you just supposed to take the arrow, the elevator right on up, no work, no nothing, just right on to the, right on to the top, fuck it. Like press success on the elevator, where are you going? Oh, I'm going about to go to uh, the success floor. Take yourself right on up to the top, you know what I mean? But that's not how it works. Now, um, there's are there shortcuts? Yeah, there's shortcuts. There's mistakes that people have made that you can learn from, you know, and you should start asking those people, you know, how they got to where they got to. A lot of them will tell you. A lot of people will fuck with you, you know what I mean? If you just gotta, you gotta be bold, you know what I'm saying? You gotta say what's up. That's really what it is, you know what I mean? That's what it is. So, um, and that's this uh, sturdy jit right here. So I'm expecting price to pull back. I know it's a strong supply zone. So as price is up high in that area, just like I know that all the pullbacks come over the weekend and then we can get back started. So the first point, I'm like 27, 27, 699. If we break through that, then definitely 27, three. And this would be a probably an excellent buy. I don't know if it's gonna come all the way down here um, just because it's holding. You know, it's been holding since the 11th in this little zone right here. Right now it's the 16th. So it's held this demand zone for like five days you feel me so it's a nice little it's strength it's, it's a lot of strength right there so basically price is just boom dug down boom and i mean it just we're really at this little consolidation zone until it figures out what it wants to do does it want to break out or does it want to drop although we're in an uptrend so it, i mean it definitely should continue you know pushing up you feel me like that's how the shit work you know so let's get that let's get that shit cracking you know what i'm saying so this is us 30 i'm gonna go ahead and keep banging that us 30 while we move over to another pair that you guys going uh call out so let's get it let's get it man keep smashing that like button keep smashing that like button keep smashing that like button no matter what you do you know what i'm saying keep smashing that like button um shit i'm building man let me tell you the truth we got we got Trey Gang in every city. Um, we about to, like i said y'all start tapping in with each other let's start building like crazy out here you know what i mean um shit 
from from tapping in with y'all i've definitely been seeing you know the energy man last night we went stupid bro i ain't even gonna tell y'all how crazy we went but we, we definitely built in you know what i'm saying i'm y'all know i be everywhere so we just making shit happen um and that's all i'm gonna say man let's get it so i'm gonna let that us 30 bang and then while us 30 bangs you guys like i said smash the chart you want um i did say i was doing gold uh next on so uh, yeah I'll, I'll let us 30 bang and then since um forex trader the actual song talks about gold on the rise 10 lot 50 lot gonna slide nick trade that's our anthem right there trade yeah run that shit up House money running the numbers, Trey. Like, you feel me? So that's what we on, and that's that energy. Let's get it. I try and niggas see the lifestyle, but I ain't really about that life. Hey, wake up every morning, check the trade and hit the lights. Take the same trade on five different brokers, get sniped. Got the city on Smash Forks, shit hitting nice. You know the name in the box, how you now? I'm that guy. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Flip that shit, run that shit back. Tread again, then I run up the pack. Mask up, then we load up the gats. Mask up. Flip that shit, run that shit back. Try to get then we, we run need up the more pack. likes. Mask up, then I load up the gas. Mask up, but we make him just clap. We've been big paid from the gig, go this that trade gang. Same thing, except we in the market with them things for your trade gang. Except we in the market, no games playing. Same thing, money moving close to the stain is the main chain. Perky popping wild bubbling all in your mainframe. You think this free? This ain't no sweepstakes, bitch. Mass 100, get this me stakes, bitch. Jerry 30 smack, but I don't fuck, she need a rent pay. Count worse the dollar, pound that pussy off the bitch pay. Money off the phone, but we don't keep it more than three days. Keep the money hot, wear a mask. To move the freeway in a free world, but we let's get it, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. So, I'm gonna speak about gold, right? And I want to start actually down here on this area chart. Now, uh, a lot of you, I mean, you it depends on how you look at a chart, it, it depends on how you look at a chart. Once you uh learn how to read, you should be able to read any chart a line chart, an area chart, a hike and ashy chart, motherfucking chart with a million bajillion indicators. If it's going up, it's going up. Don't matter how you look at your gauge, it just you know, some of y'all need extra uh shit extra shit going on you know what i mean and, uh shout out to everybody i know look our the people who trade crypto and trade gang are really going up out here man so shout out to y'all um i know we got number one on the leaderboard on binance so shout out to bryce you know what i'm saying that's bryce tv holding it down for that you know what i'm saying like i said man i, I don't mind you know shouting out all the trade gang niggas out here really making shit happen so bro's number one on the leaderboard right now real trade gang shit over on binance so if you guys really trying to get that crypto shit uh cracking like we're number one on binance you know what i mean so definitely want to tap into the discord man start tapping into the community start tapping into the unit and get popping um they know what they talk about they on these bitcoin futures they on these crypto futures going to fuck up like i said that's the only way you're gonna be able to smack that number one spot you know what i mean so you guys definitely go ahead and check out more inside that discord man um somebody go ahead and uh, drop the discord um drop the discord in the uh where the fuck you know what i'm talking about <laughs> Hey, like this nigga Ty stay losing his train of thought. I really do though. I really do. So this is gold on the area chart, right? And shout out to uh, Latoya Robert. She donated again, so appreciate that. Let's get it. So this is gold on the area chart. Now, as you see, um, from well October, what is this? October nineteenth or twenty? I'm saying nineteen, like the twenty twenty nineteen. Right now we're in twenty twenty. So October uh, twenty nineteen to December. I mean, prices were kind of stagnant. You know what I mean? It was kind of stagnant. The price of gold was kind of stagnant. Nothing was really going on. Okay, so as we get into like January 2020, at the start of the, in the beginning of this year, that's when gold prices got up and it starts showing us gains. So we got crazy gains, crazy gains. We got to 1600 in a hill. The major correction in gold, we already had one major correction. Boom, that major correction came to 14. Okay, so then we had like four, three was from March, March, April, May, June, March, April, May, June, July, and now we're in August. So now we're at almost six months of gain in gold, all right? We did six months of gain, and then boom, a major correction. So in a sense, we've already had the two major corrections. So price of gold should continue, you know, gaining um, on the up and up. We're gonna go into it and break it down more a little bit again as well, you know, so we can keep getting it cracking. All right, tap in, make sure you guys smash that like button. Make sure you smash that like button. All right, so. You're probably wondering why do I always just have these little, you know, quick little support and resistance channels and I don't have all that confluent shit, all that confusing shit on my charts because I like to be able to read, man. I don't, I'm not even about to be a uh, hundred, I mean, I'm not about to be a hundred. I'm not even about to uh, be on no, no flex shit. Like, I just like the naked charts. Like, to be honest, I like looking at the market like this. Boom. You know what I mean? But if this is up, it I mean, it's cool too. I kind of know the direction, but really I just like looking at that bitch. It's just the beauty of it. The same way how we went over to that area chart and was able to explain the history of what's going on. You know what I'm saying? Just by being able to kind of know what's going on. Like it's, it's obvious, you know what I mean? 
So gold, where I feel like gold is going for the week. Do I feel like it's going to push back up to that 2000 mark? Now, to be honest, I don't know if gold is going to push back up there this week, okay? Because we already had that drastic correction, which dropped like 1800. And we spoke about that on my Twitch. So I don't know who was able to um, to grab some, some, some shit. But we definitely spoke, like I said, we spoke about that on Twitch, okay? So um, yeah, you know, you got that, you got that retest. And then also, uh, I mean, you know, that was the rebuy. You want to know why the price of gold shot back up so fast. I mean, because it was just like the correction that I showed you back in what it was 2019 or 2020 or some shit like the uh, it was the beginning of 2020. You know, what I mean, before March. So uh, that's just what it was. It had to correct itself. Like once the price gets that high and it's that inflated, it, it like it's just inevitable that price must correct itself. And if it doesn't, then it's like, it, how would you, how would the new investors have a chance to get in and the prices are so fucking high? Like, it, it's going to drop because people would just sit back and wait for it to drop. You know what I mean? Like, you you know what? I'll just wait to get in. Just uh, wait to get in. You know what I'm saying? You know? You know, huh? This shit, man. But nah, so, go. All right, so ultimately, we already know we're going to get back to this 20, what is this? This mark up here. All right. So price has already kind of filled this demand area in a sense that it already kind of filled an uh, area that is already retested and it's a strong possibility that we could get a retest, okay? Um, it's only what? Gold moves like 30 to $50 a day. So if it did minus $50 in one day, it'd take us to like 1890, which I feel like would be a fucking amazing buy. If you miss that shit, bro, it's like you just gonna miss the train again. You know what I mean? So saying like boom price slipped down a little bit just to get some retest or 1915 or some shit like that that's the bottom of this little zone right here all right not saying we're gonna come down to this purple because that was like low low but i'm saying we get down to like 1915 1910 just as a little retest and then go on the rise 10 lots 50 lot going slide then we get to that uh what is this this first candlestick so that is 2040 then at 2040 probably retest to like I don't know if it's gonna go to 1979, but definitely it probably retest like twenty, thirty dollars, about two thousand again. Then price shoot back up and we get to this area. So it's gonna take us a minute to get up there, but for sure, for sure, for sure, for sure, uh, we can get it cracking. Yo, what's up, Jay Reckless? Yo, bro, tap in with me, bro. I know I be lagging on the projects, bro. Probably like this nigga Ty say tap in every week, bro. Bro be capping. <laughs> nah, no cap. I fuck with y'all. I fuck with y'all. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Can we get can we get some more likes in this bitch though? Can we get some more likes in this bitch? Make sure y'all go spam the website to tradegang.com. Tradegang.com. Let's get it. Let's get it. See, I see me people over there getting them free courses and shit. Y'all turn it up right now. Y'all turn it up right now. So yeah, they over there on the uh, on the site bagging them free courses, getting them just up. Feel me? Let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. We need more likes, though. We need more likes, though. We need more likes, though. Hey, I don't know what's going on with my dashboard. It's not even letting me see my comments or anything. You feel me? But that's where I feel like gold is on go. So the first ticket, we drop a little bit just because I feel like a correction is there. And I could be wrong. The price market could open up, gap up, and just shoot up to 2000 Like, fuck your whole analysis and all of you shit you niggas is waiting on. We'll do whatever we want. I mean, because with the correction, it did whatever we wanted. It dropped all the way down to the 1800s. Fuck, fuck us all. You know what I'm saying? So we had crazy gains just like, oh, man, we got to wait. You know what I'm saying? Low back up at the bottom and shoot right back up to the top again. You know what I'm saying? To the top side. So let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. How do I feel about trading on value? To be honest, I feel like all of that shit is bullshit. I mean, yeah, I know it's a part of the market. You know what I mean? I know it's a part of the market and stuff like that. But to be honest, like, y'all know I don't care. Damn, we got five likes. Five people got to get beat up. Shit. Hey, please don't come to the show with that hate. Nigga, there will be mosh pits. You feel me? Like, Trey Gang, I'm going to tell you the truth. Like, we got, we got some old heads that fuck with us. But it's a very young, youthful environment. And, I mean, shit. If niggas wasn't uh, trading, they'd be doing a whole bunch of other wild shit. So, right now, they're just distracted with the Forex. You know what I mean? And I feel like you should let the youth and, you know, and the millennials just be distracted with the Forex. Now, you start fucking up that money and that vibe. Well... Yo, how you feel about niggas fucking with your money and your vibe? <laughs> and that's just what it is. You know what I'm saying? And that's just what it is. He said, bro, you was high when you was learning Forex? Shit. Probably every second of it. Now, see, I wasn't smoking indica because I was off the sativas. That's that, that learning weed. You know what I mean? But let's get on from gold, man. Let's get on from gold. And let's uh, go over to uh, what I said we were going to go to. We was going to do which ones? Talk to me. Please talk. Who won a challenge? I don't know. I gotta look. I don't know who even uh, entered. I don't know some people entered on. Uh, I don't know some people entered on 
on YouTube. Some people entered on Twitter. I got people on the Discord. So really, uh, I'll extend that shit one more week, you know. But this is the Forex Trader Challenge. All right, I'm going to send it one more week. Now, you got $500. I feel like the 500 is light to what you need to do, okay? You got 400, uh, 400. <laughs> you got two, week, two weeks. You have to hold a trade for 48 hours. You can look, you don't even have to, a lot of people failed the challenge, which is ridiculous because you could even scale your shit down to 0 0.01 on a blank account, you know what I'm saying, with no stop loss and just let it run. You know what I mean? Like, now if it's wrong, it's gonna fuck you and you definitely should have a stop loss for sure, for sure. But if it's right, like your runner is just gonna run, bro. You like, you don't, what are you, what are you doing? Let that shit run. You know what I mean? What's that? Buy in May, go away. Hey, buy in May, hey, go away. Hey, buy in May, yeah, go away. You feel me? You know the, you know the, you know it. Let's get it, let's get it. So, let's turn it up. Oh man, I'm almost at 73,000 subs on YouTube. The, to be honest, we got another dislike. That's somebody else that's about to get beat up, bro. Like, nah, they not gonna beat us up, bro. Fuck you, they talking about, like, bro. I mean, shit, it's all good. Like I said, we will mingle. We will see you at the show. Please do not join the mosh pits, nigga. Please do not join the mosh pits. <laughs> Let's get it. All right. Hey, call out a pair though, or call out. You know what we what you what we marking up next? While you do that, I'm gonna let that forest trader bang in the background and let's get through it. It's gonna move a little bit faster now. Um, I've explained everything for the newbies, and now we are gonna speed this shit up and start getting it cracking. But definitely smash that like button, smash that like button. You feel me? Let's get it. I'm about to let that forest trader bang right now. You already know who I am. Yo, and then Furus won't really add me, nigga, cause they not really bout that motherfucking life. Hey, hey, fuck it up, uh. Fuck it up, fuck it up, fuck it up. Hey, Trey gang shit gon' lock for a dub. Plus down coast T5 on thumb. Trey, hey, what's the runs now? Still a German 30 on the bus down. Trey, hey, yeah, it's hitting, huh? Got gold runners hitting on the touchdown. Index funds running, so what's up now? XPS 500, keep the truck loud. Trey, hey, talk my shit, yeah, keep it on demand. Hey, y'all, I'm going to show y'all a simple trick. Now, I know that you got a lot of food rules that's out here trying to confuse the hell out of you with confluences and, di like, they're going to throw every fucking term in a book at your ass to confuse the shit at you. I'm going to show you something simple right quick about these motherfucking channels so you ain't got to spend your money with them bitch-ass nicks. Trey! Fuck you talk about, weirdo. Hey, money on ways. Keep the black tins because a nigga don't play. Keep the sticky hot off the rip every day. Yo mentor been on our dick. They been wanting to fucking do everything that we've been doing. Niggas just follow along, nigga, cause the songs is real. Copy and paste ass niggas, bitch. Hey, hey, fuck it up, uh. Fuck it up, fuck it up, fuck it up. Hey, Trey gang shit gon' lock for a dub. Bust down coast, T5 on thumb. Trey, hey, what's the dealio? No force course, niggas, what you really on? Trey, you just copy all my videos. We know your whole game, that's why we in control. Trey, mask up, mask up. Black mask shit, hey shit, go dumb. Shit when they run, better pay y'all or we coming for the funds. Trey, so you think I'm on one? We in the money game, tryna snatch at your plugs. Focus on face like they got it, so what? Big reps on face like we mobbing, what's up? Still on stilts like the rockin' them drums. Battles of the family, family, yes, up. Move out the shadows to the front of the bus. Move out the race of elite to the trust. Trey, run that shit up. House money, bustin' the numbers. Trey, hey, go to on the rocks. Ten lives. Let's get it though. Let's get it though. Let's get it though. I can't wait to bang that shit, man, with the motherfucking stadium speakers. We're gonna be going up, man. Appreciate all you guys who are donating. Appreciate all you guys who are donating, man. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. But look, 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 let's get it. So initially the market was in a downtrend. What pair am I on? I am on. I'm no longer on the indexes. I'm no longer on commodities. I am on Australian dollar, US dollar. All right. This is the one week chart. So I'm gonna show you a secret with these trend lines, you know what I'm saying? So you don't have to go take a a, a course on some bullshit. Whatever. Like I got the free shit, the free course 
course, should put you on game to all of the terms. So if you want to learn some terminology to confuse you more other than keeping shit simple, I mean, because really that's all it is, is jargon. Niggas just be making shit up. Fuck it. Like, hey, look at this. These are the, that's the, did you see the eyeglass? Yeah, let me go ahead and create the eyeglass pattern now. You know, you got to sell the fucking eyeglass system. You know, it's just stupid. Like, nigga, are, you mean buy at the bottom and sell at the top? <laughs> you feel me? So let's get it, man. Let's get it. So initially, the, the the market was in a downtrend. The old trend turned into a bullish channel. So you see how this channel was? It was down. So you would be you would have been looking for shorting opportunities in that market. But now look what the market is in. It did it did it not change? So now we're gonna turn this right here, right? Put these greens right here, and I'll go ahead. And the thing is, this is a weekly. So to be honest, I could just lead us right here, and the whole channel should fulfill itself. You know what I mean? So. I'll just leave it just like this. Let the whole shit just fulfill itself. And uh, that's my new channel. So now we're no longer in a down channel because the channel is going up. So I'm going to go ahead and turn this red. Let me go turn this red. Turn this red real quick, man. Turn this red. And then so boom. And now just like that. You know what I mean? And it's crazy. Look. Motherfucking. Nigga, they, don't they sell you this shit for two bands? Nigga, they be selling you this shit for two bands, bro. This is some bullshit. This is some bullshit. That's how, you know, look, I'm going to tell you the truth. I seen one of your mentors, bro. One of your mentors, no cap, no cap. Bro posted a screenshot that he made like 70 to 100 grand. It was like 70 to 100 grand. Literally, nigga, the next five tweets on Twitter was pleased by my course. I'm like, damn, like, you make 70 to 100 grand. Are you really fucking pressing mentorships and memberships like that? Like, and then you got to think, like, so if you're doing this shit every day, like, what's the point of pressing, pressing? in that shit like it at, it becomes a point where you don't even want to fuck with people you you're like you know what i mean like it, you got shit in place like but i mean niggas not at that level we talking real wealth now we're talking real wealth like can you get a meeting with warren buffett <laughs> you know what i'm saying like it's levels to this shit it's levels to this shit the challenge is still up yeah i said i extended it for a week i extended it for a week i extended it for a week so you guys um let's get it let's get it hey ty do you know Guys in America trade synthetic indexes as options or CFDs. You can talk about the synthetic joints of, uh, what's them synthetic joints? My my YouTube revenue, you can go to, uh, what's that website? Um, Social Blade, it, all my stats is there, bro. All my stats is there. None of my shit, none of my shit hidden to the public, you know, so it's all there, it's all there. Let's get it. But this is the channel that we're on. So now we're gonna go from the weekly. All right, now we're gonna go from the weekly, go break that did, did down and go into the daily, okay? This is the daily. So in a bullish channel, what are we trying to do? Find buying opportunities. Oh my gosh. You're like, well, he got all these lines right here. Check this out. Boop. Now I don't, pussy. You feel me? So let's get it. This is where we're at. We know we're on the uptrend. And then what am I looking for? I'm looking for a demand zone or I'm looking for a zone where I see a lot of action. Now, there's not really too much crazy action to the upside. You know what I mean? So when you look up here, there's not too much shit going on. Yeah, we can. you can be like, oh, this is divergence. But then in a sense, it's already kind of pushed down off this area and here we are at the bottom of this little channel so this is the daily and i found so we went to the weekly found some bigger channels came down to the daily and found some smaller channels so now this is where you're at on the daily now if you know anything about support and resistance i know your your furu i tell you that you can't use support and resistance because they really need your money the thing is they don't have no fucking um long-term wealth investing strategies it's just get your money spend it to flex on you and then beg you to buy again because now you got to afford all them fucking leases like this shit is stupid you know what i mean but <sighs> that's you know that's that's what it is bro that's what it is bro you know what i mean but this shit the forex market is simple and the quicker you understand that the quicker you'll be profitable you know so now you got to ask yourself where we're at now we're in the demand zone boom has price left now it keeps getting rejected at like 71 800 you know what i'm saying or what's the highest of that 71.9 it keeps getting jacked at 71.8 71.9 so now we got a roof so you ask me well what's price supposed to do or where are we going well this is the demand zone i feel like price needs to go ahead and continue this little uptrend that it's on we looked at the weekly scene of uptrend and uh now it should continue to uptrend so we should get to the 72 72 uh like a, what is that 100 pips which is uh 72 um 796 
right now we're at 71707 so i mean that's looking like where the weekly is going we don't have any true break under here this is july so it's really been holding this 71 70 or 71 price um and i feel like we are going to get to that 72 cent this is 0 0.71 cent and then when we get up here it's going to be 0 0.72 cent so i feel like price should get up to that 0 0.72 cent um price should be bullish for the week are we going to see retest we're going to see a retest of course because that is how the market works so first you're gonna go ahead and see that retest and then you're gonna get it cracking but like i said just before you before you go spend your money with a furu please come test the system out man for the f uh how you can test the trade gang system out is just going to the discord um and somebody go ahead and drop the discord in there you said do i use the fibs um sometimes like i had the fibs up on my nasdaq or something like that to check some retraces maybe like a few days back and i think we talked about it on twitch or something like that i even did a lesson on the fibs on twitch uh, i went over a whole fucking you know lesson on uh, on the fibs i think we were 10 minutes in depth or some shit you know what i mean so it was pretty solid like i said this big cream shirt be smacking i think it's smack on white too like on white is fire for like the blue because i got the blue with the you know what i'm saying like i got a tie in there i had to go with everything i'm getting them shits made like crazy you know what i'm saying so this shit is dope but really like i like that market close shit you feel me i like that market close shit like the market close shirt y'all gonna see that in the music video you're gonna be like bro bro you feel me you said five nine furus rewatching the screen getting ready for their zoom calls on oh, god them niggas gonna be on zoom calls all day because they gotta recoup that bread because they spent it all on trying to flex you feel me this how they, this how they marketing go you gotta get the money from the people spend it because you gotta look like something like you can't just be yourself fuck that who's themselves now <laughs> right spend it because you gotta look like something you're not you know what i'm saying rent a lifestyle and then once you're done you can't really post as much as you want to because you didn't sold this fake ass lifestyle so you really can't be posting like like you really want to post because it's like damn like you know what i mean so it's like shit you ask me why i don't post nigga i'm off twitch every single day i'll be on twitter every day or you can watch my insta stories i'll be fucking spamming my posts i don't give a damn you feel me but yeah so that's where i feel like price is going and then uh that's what it is you know so for the week um 72 cent right now we're at 71 cents so i feel like i can go up a cent you feel me let's get it what is the discord somebody go ahead and mark the discord in there i'm about to turn on another track and then we're gonna go ahead and go to the um I'm about to put on that trader die because that's really the lifestyle. Who really out here living that trader die lifestyle though? Like on some real shit. I want to know who where the real forex traders at, where the real investors are at, where the real stock uh, stock boys is at. You know what I'm saying? Really let me know what's good in the motherfucking chat, man. Go ahead, go to that tradegame.com too and go grab you some shit too. We're about to get on this trader die real quick and I'm about to go over to uh, let's do my fucking GU right now. Let's get it. We are gonna move a little bit faster and let's let's move. So I'm gonna go GU EU um, New Zealand. Fuck it, we do New Zealand. Uh, uh, German, I'm uh, German. <laughs> Great British pound, Japan, uh, Japan yen, Australian dollar, Jap, USD, Mexican, and then uh, Bitcoin, and then we're gonna get about this bitch for the for the Sunday. Feel me? So let's go ahead, put Trader Die on, and then I'm about to breeze through these jits. I think I've been on here for about an hour, an hour, something like that. I don't know how long I've been on here, but you know I've been trying to get that uh, that time up, you know that streaming time. So appreciate for sure, for sure, everybody who really rock with me on these Sundays. You guys are a vibe. You guys are a vibe, man. I know these Sunday shits are a vibe. So really, it's dope getting on here and just uh, you know, shit getting it cracking like that but like i said man like if, if the niggas who really making this bread like you make a let me let me ask you something chat let me ask you something no cap you make a hundred bands in a day what do you do a try to make another hundred bands tomorrow or b ask niggas to come buy your mentorship in your course bro you make a hundred two hundred three hundred why the fuck bro fuck you niggas like that like that though like that though Are you right damn like that like come on bro what no you wouldn't fucking be bothered <laughs> <laughs> Don't even want to fucking be bothered. You know what I mean? Let's get this motherfucking shit going on. Trader die. It's up right now. Let's get it. Shout out to all y'all. Smash that like button. What makes me a real trader? I don't have to sell none of that fluff and none of that furu shit. Um, most of my shit is swing trading. I'm always talking about long-term shit. I'm always doing long-term shit. So what makes me real is I won't fucking do all that fake uh, fraud shit niggas is doing for the, for the folks money. Um, people say they for the community. I can get this shit out for the F nigga and it don't affect my pockets. I don't gain or I don't lose. You know what I'm saying? By just speaking about the information and putting it out there so people in my community can pick up on it. You know what I'm saying? So I guess if that doesn't make me real, then I don't give a fuck if you believe I'm real or not. But when I pull up on you, just know like it's real. You know what I'm saying? and my car probably taller than you you know what i mean so shit let's get it 
And I know people, y'all go out here and get a million loans. Like, you don't need to do that, man. Save your fucking money. Be smart. Invest for the future. Go buy more bread. Like, you, every time you spend bread, you don't need to let nobody know. It's not our business. But if you want to make it our business, then fuck it. Okay, stupid. <laughs> we'll watch. You feel me? So this GU played out perfectly. Um, if you guys are on my Twitch and shit, then I mean you pretty much know. That's why I got the Twitch at the bottom. But you'll pretty much know where we're at. I'll speak about it more in a second. I'm gonna let the song bang for a minute, and then we're gonna talk about GU. But this is the daily chart. Alright, so I would speak about GU. Um, I go over this on Twitch all the time, but I'm gonna go over it with you guys again and speak what an uptrend is. Alright, one more time. I wake up in the morning, check my trades and toss my phone. Every day is trade or die, so keep the numbers out the road. Keep the linen in the sheets up in the yard while hanging. Let's get it, let's get it. You said you like that Forex drill? Hell yeah. What's your favorite Tyler Yenner song too? Let me know in the chat. What's your favorite Tyler Yenner song? Let me know in the chat. So, what's cool about Uptrends is this. It's three parts to Uptrend. All right, if you don't know this, um, it's here. Uh, I built this out on Twitch and I literally have not fucked with it. Every time we get on Twitch, we just come here and we just watch this shit. We talk about it and it's doing what it's supposed to do. You know what I mean? So, you got this first leg, which is the push. Now, I know they'll charge you a billion dollars to learn this shit. I'm gonna tell you, you go on fucking baby pitch, they do this shit for free. Go to my fucking uh, website. What's the website? The Trey Gang website, the TreyGang.com. Um, type in free course and it's you. I mean, you're gonna learn this shit, it's simple. It's simple, it's simple. Put in the work, okay? But this is the first leg, which is the push up. So first market pushes up. Pushes up, because it has to. You feel me? The next part after the push up there is, boom, so. After it push up, the next part, it stops. It gets to this little high point, right? It gets to this little high point. And then it's like, damn, well, what happens next? What happens next? And then price starts to retrace because like it got to exhaust. That's the that's how the market works. It doesn't, like I said, it, you guys want this elevator success to go straight up, boom. But that, that's not how the market works, how success works. There's no straight past, there's no straight past the success. It's like, <laughs> shit all over the place you know what i'm saying so it's all over the fucking place and shit like that so it's like man shit bro it, you gotta literally think about i mean the, the market's just like that it's the markets are a reflection of us because it's a reflection of human psychology and how we move how we think how we buy how we consume you know what i mean so uh that's just what it is some days some days will be good days and some days are going to be bad days and that's always just what it is there's no way around it so boom we got our first push market pushes up then you got this second push which is the accumulation lake or the accumulation phase or that retracement phase so you got to figure out what market is doing and why it hasn't broke through so then that's in a sense where we're at right here you feel me we're at this little second leg right now this little accumulation phase right here so right now we were here it started to retrace a little bit boom started really and then this is where we're at in this little diamond area so i could take this we're in this little area right here feel me and smack that right here boom is that not the same structure and you're like it's not that simple you need to use your fucking confluence and if you don't put a fibonacci in there then it's just not right it's not right i already know in the year 1942 we invented the fibonacci head ass the fuck up you feel me but uh so that's that so now we're in this phase so in a sense we're just waiting for price to pretty much break to the upside if it, it's a possibility it could keep floating just a little bit it could keep floating just a little bit just because we could still retest a little bit more you feel me but look i'm gonna show you something i'm gonna go down too um i'm gonna go down too and show you something in a second you feel me go down and show you something in a second too all right so why is he showing us this when is he getting off this let me go run on my streams i'm playing with me 
all right so here's a demand zone so not only in that area is it accum accumulation you got a demand zone as well but then i mean the supply zone is strong too so you got a range so price just went up got in this little range area like this got in this little range area start trying to figure out what it want to do bouncing it doesn't know what it wants to do and the next thing it wants to do because we are in an uptrend and it when the indexes start pushing then this should just psh, float on with it too and it goes into community uh, what is this consolidation accumulation again like i said bro make it go to tradegain.com man learn this shit for the f bro it's just simple or you could throw all that shit on your charts and confuse yourself you feel me so that's what it is so this is the daily all right now I'm about to break it down. We're going to go into a smaller time frame. We're going to the four hour. You should see some pulling back. Yep. So this is what you see into the four hour. So once we get here, I can delete all of this right here. I could delete this too if you need to see. I can see clearly now. Head ass. You feel me? So this is what that is. And then this little yellow one is when we went into the hour and found, you know, how the marks was going to move inside of the yellow as well. So pull back, probably pull back to the 130. It's like 80 pips. But I don't feel like it's going to do all that. What's the 16th, 14th, 13th? So it'll probably pull back to 584. Um, right now it's at 858, so like 30 pips, probably hold, and they start pushing up to the upside. Now it's a possibility, could it been? It could, but it's been holding, you know, from July to August, it's really been holding this little uh, 130 to 131 range. So that's the range that has been holding for the last two weeks, three weeks. So um, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. He said, no hotel meeting freestyle before I get off stream. I got you. Damn, y'all really want to, y'all really be fucking with that. Okay, I rock with that. I rock with that. We could do it. Rose Royce Energy, for sure, for sure. So, I mean, that's that's what we see with GU. Um, let's move along. Let's move along. Let's go over to the Euro. We did AU. We did GU. Let's get over to that Euro. Let's get over to that Euro. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Easy call. So, in this, you're probably wondering why he has all of this stuff on here. So, you're like, what is all that shit on your charts? All right, so, what I was explaining on my Twitch, okay? I have to re-explain it because... I'll be having shit everywhere sometimes just when I have to explain, but this is what it is. So I could delete this, boom, you already know what it is. This is my weekly. All right, got the double booty on the weekly. The previous trend, that's all I had. So, in a sense, I'll, well, I'll show you right now. All right, I'll show you what I had. I think I marked this up on a weekly. There it is. Yeah, so I did mark it up on a weekly. So this is the weekly. So what time frame am I on? 1W. Um, somebody let me know uh, what 1W is in the chat. If you guys don't know, somebody let me know what 1W is in the chat. And then also what I need you to do is smash that like button. So if you haven't already, you need to go ahead and just smash the like button. I mean, because the thing is, YouTube really loves when you smash the like button. I don't know what it is about smashing the like button. They just like, you know, they love it. So keep smashing the like button. If you're active and you can see this shit, you got to smash that like button. Um, shout out to everybody who's been subscribing to all the new subs. We definitely, you know, I see us growing over here every single day, We're growing as a, a, as a family, as a community. Um, this is one of the most interesting, you know, uh, I would say forest communities, but we definitely... Um, we've definitely you know surpassed you know what what that was and what was what it was to be so uh the growth is extremely good and um yeah man i definitely fuck with y'all and appreciate you guys fucking with this new joint too the the new um you know the new sounds and stuff i even see the bots on the new sounds talking talking about some joint you know and uh shit like that so he said i never explains a wash trading because i don't give a fuck about wash trading you go confuse yourself with that shit i literally look at these little i got four lines on my chart b these four lines that help me not be as confused as you now what i learned was to follow the path to successful and do it i don't know what the fuck you learned nigga but i mean you just gotta pay attention and move how the sharks move man and that's what it is you feel me do i think corona messing the markets up now Man, we spoke about Corona. We spoke about vaccines. I feel like, to be honest, it's been improving the market rather than affecting it in a in a bad way. You know what I mean? But here's the the weekly markup. So, as we showed you on Australian dollar, price was what it was in a downtrend. But is it anymore? No, it's the market's not down anymore. It's not a bearish market anymore. You know. So now, what market are we in? Boom. Okay. Where do I feel like price is going to hit? Price is at 118 right now. I feel like prices will inflate all the way up to about this area right here, which is 125, 126. Right now it's at 118. So that's my long-term outlook. Now let's go to the daily. You probably like, why, he's, why does he have this shit in the daily? So I'm going to show you something. And you, these green lines are my weekly, so don't even, I know it looks like fucking chopsticks, but don't, don't even worry. Matter of fact, I'll rebuild it for you. All right. So all I'm doing and all I was saying is 
look, when price splits up, you got one, boom, boom, right, boom. And then I'm saying now we're in this phase, right? Bam. So and since now we're in this second little phase, so the next phase for us to go through is to the upside. Although I noticed that this was a flag. And you're like, what do you mean? Well, if I take, right, another resistance line and throw that shit right on the top, make sure you guys go get that free shit from the, uh, from the store too. It's there for you guys. And uh, make sure you subscribe to our email list because that's when I'm going to be sending out dope ass updates. Like, you know, so that's where we're at. So price peel back a little bit, pull back a little bit. We had, you know, three green days and that's cool. But I spoke about the pullback already. I showed you on, on NAS, I showed you on the index season. I feel like prices are high. So they do need a pullback before we can get in. So the week starts, price pulls back a little bit, probably drop to like 117.9, 117.8. You feel me around here? I don't know if it's gonna fill this whole gap right here. So around here, you feel me? Probably come back, retest that one more time. If we continue pushing, then boom, we're gonna see that 119 and we can keep going up. It's a flag. So really with flags, you don't know how long it's gonna, flag down before it shoots back up and then creates that flag again and then shoots back up you feel me so that's what that is so i'm just re-explaining and also um i'll show you the demand zone as well i'll put this back on here you feel me this little purple that was a demand zone so all that is is fucking support that's all it is i know they're gonna confuse you and tell you it's everything else but it's support it's support and resistance supply is support supply is resistance and then demand is support okay but the only difference is is when you draw it you just draw a box instead of a line whoa <laughs> whoa feel me so that's euro usd that's where i feel like that's going and let's get to that next shit so what's the next one i think i said uh let's do gj we could do gj let's do gj and a lot of people trade gj and this was on uh i had a weekly fib on gj all right so you asked me if i'd use the fib and sometimes yeah i do all right so that's my weekly fib okay so i'll explain what i see why does this keep i'll explain what i see all right so ultimately i already know that price is on the up and up but i'm just using it because i know a lot of people a lot of investors use the fib and they go by these little psychological numbers over here so how i'm using it is i'm really i got the fib up but i'm watching these numbers and i'm watch i'm watching where price is at and as it gets to the number so a few days ago price was near like the 50 on the fib and it sat there and we spoke about it on the stream I'm like yo it's at the 50 it just hasn't broke out yet and then boom that shit breaks out of the breaks out of the 50 right where was that at or was it? The, it was a fifty. It was a sixty-one point eight. My bad. Price break. Uh, bright, I said price. Bright, uh, price breaks out of there and just keeps moving uh, to the upside. All right. So we go down to the daily. Boom. Now we got price approaching that fifty. So that's why you see start to see it pull back. And then I mean, really, I called this zone right here as where the pullback was on come to, and that is one thirty-nine three hundred three. Price kind of already filled that. I feel like we can go down a little bit more. It's a possibility um, to 138.226. That's if like that's if, if price is just like you know what, fuck it like it is what it is. But before we hit that, we'll hit 138.5. So I feel like if anything, we'll probably hit that 138.5 and try to sit there and then continue to the upside. I don't know if the pullback is gonna come back that far, but I mean it's it's Sunday. Market's gonna move slow. Uh, it has to do its little accumulation phase shit. It has to go ahead and pull back, and then um, once it pulls back, then we for sure for sure will be able to make the uh, make that shit crack. You know what I mean? So let's get it popping. Let's get it popping. So this is uh, GJ. Yeah, this is GJ. All right, let's get it. So this is GJ. All right. So I could delete this. And if you want to see intraday shit like four hour shit that's what it is so price has to retest a little bit um come down i said it was gonna retest to about this area right here that was the demand zone boom i don't know if it's gonna drop to this whole joint right here you feel me that's like 138 to 138.3 so quick little retest to that possibly and then boom to the upside is it gonna come you gotta trade what you see really from the 13th until the 16th, we had we kind of sat at this support right here. So if price does not break through this 139.2 area, 
then I mean it's just going to continue to the upside. So this support you can see 139.2, 139.150. Uh, then you should start seeing the price just go ahead and topple to the downside, come and retest is 138, and then try to start moving back to the upside again like that. So um, we got two places that you know market could go. Make sure y'all smash that like button though. Make sure y'all smash that like button. Make sure y'all smash that like button. Where we at? We almost out of K likes. So we need to get to that thousand likes. We need to get to that thousand likes. We need to get to that thousand likes. All right, so this GJ, we're gonna go to uh, Australian dollar, Japanese in a second. Um, I mean, let's get it like that. Boom, and while we do that, I'm gonna end I mean, coat. Y'all getting that shit up though, no cap. I'm liking that you got the songs up, like it's popping, you feel me? For sure popping. I already know the fucking Tyolianer type beats are gonna start dropping soon. So that's soon. I, especially after this Forest Trader video, I, I feel like it's gonna change the forest world. Like this shit is wild, bro. It's really wild. And it's only gonna get more wild. So yeah. Cool. Aye, aye, aye. And I mean cool. aye, aye, aye. And I mean cool. And I mean coke, trading and I mean coke And Versace Rose, young and out of control Shoot my shot, knock him down like a free throw Shoot my shot, knock him down like his dominoes And I mean coke, trading and I mean coke And Versace Rose, young and out of control Shoot my shot, knock him down like a free throw Shoot my shot, knock him down like his dominoes Ay, 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 ay Voice too good, every day and payday, wait, day Never on the way, that just an ass to the V to the J Running around Let's get it, let's get it. Okay. Honey, breathe, breathe, bitch, I stay with respect. Yeah. Hundred degrees in the G to the max. I'm in the market, need D with the packs, little bitch. I got forks, saddled on my tempo. You can sit full, sorry, but it's tempo. Okay. Hang a line in the market, it's a lynch, bro. We in the field with two scores with the big trust. And I'm eco, trading and I'm eco. And Versace Rose, young and out of control. Shoot my shot, knock him down like a free throw. Shoot my shot, knock him down like it's dominoes. And I'm eco, trading and I'm For improve it every time I speak a stock Check the charts, I'ma do it If I tell that bitch to jump, then it jump If I get pissed, we all selling that junk Six four is the way that we crashing the fuck We smashing these records, this fashion the fuck Ay, 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 ay And I'm eco, trading and I'm eco And Versace Rose, young and out of control Shoot my shot, knock him down like a free throw Shoot my shot, knock him down like it's dominoes And I'm eco, trading and I'm eco And Versace Rose, young and out of control Shoot my shot, knock him down Easy call, easy call, easy call. Yo, so the shit's super simple. So all I did though, no cap, right? Came over here. I don't even have to, uh, I didn't even have to put no confluences. I didn't have to put no divergence. I ain't had to put nothing on my charts, no volumes, no motherfucking moving averages, none of that. If you need all that, you know what I'm saying? That's dope and all. I feel like that's gonna definitely uh, be pretty cool. You know what I'm saying? I feel like that's a, uh, that's a dope way to look at the market to definitely keep you um, confused. But check it out. A way to get it cracking, right? This is the week. So this is these are weekly channels. So at first, as you've seen, man, from 2017 all the way until March 2020, shit, the market was on the fucking low. It was dropping. We did have a bearish market. It was. It was dropping. That's that's why the channel is down. You keep seeing lower lows. You know, you keep seeing these lower lows. This is the weekly. So I mean, you kept seeing lower lows. All right. But now, but now, right? What's the market doing? It's no longer in this channel. It broke out of this shit. It's no longer here. It broke out. Now, we're this way. All right. Now we're this way. So that's what channel we're in, and that's what we're reading. So we're expecting price to just continue flying through this shit. Like, what's to stop it? Like, it already did a whole fucking what? 2017, and three years are down. It dropped for three years. Now, I mean, we're expecting the market to continue rising and doing well, you know? And boom. Okay. So that's where uh, I see that going. Okay, we'll go ahead and delete this off the charts. Boom, boom, one day. So this is the day. So now we already got your bigger channels. Now you just come in, 
Uh, if you want to, I mean, you can, you know, delete it off there. I like leaving it just because, you know, fuck it. I come in and see where I'm at. So now I'm paying attention to the smaller shit. So I see where we're at. I got crazy little demand area right here. So I know price could. Well, what's cool about this is a little pin bar. If you know the story, it is. I'll tell you what it is real quick. All right, price fucking shoots up a little bit, little bit, drops down, comes back up, and then closes right here. Boom, you feel me? So that's the that's that that candlestick. So it's like price shot down. Well, price shot up, shot down, and then came back up, and that's why you have that little J like that. All right, so that's the story of that candlestick. So that's what we have right here on this day. So where I feel like price is gonna go. In a sense, it's like a cup with a handle. You feel me? You're like, no, it's not. But then, yes, it is. Like, I can go ahead and make this a coffee mug. You know what I mean? Like, Snickers drawing coffee mugs on the chart. Well, that's a cup with a handle. You know what I'm saying? So, if you don't know what a cup with a handle is, then you should definitely go and fucking go to um, Forex Cheat Sheet. You feel me? Type in Forex Cheat Sheet and be like, oh, man, what's that? He said, look at this motherfucker. He drew, he drew a blunt on the chart. He drew a... Coffee mug on the chart. He's there's no way. There's just no way this guy's a forex trader. No way. All these people in this chat, I don't even know why they watch this guy. This is some bullshit. Let me just log out right now. <laughs> you feel me? But uh let's get it. Let's get it. Hey, this nigga OG NASA, a big hater. Bro, I'm gonna just put you on mute and you can't even talk. Watch this. Oh, now you're in timeout. <laughs> Show bitch ass up, nigga. Get off my stream. Stop sucking my dick, pussy. You feel me? Why you on here if you don't like me? Because you know this is that real shit. This is that real game. That's why you on here. You feel me? Now, when you get back off your little timeout, then you can think about it. Do I really want to stay on this stream and keep talking shit? Or Ty just going to keep putting me in timeout and trolling me just because this nigga is fucking, that's just what he does. So let's get it. And I really did draw a, draw a cup on the chart and I really drew a blunt on the chart because that's how I feel about Forex, bro. This shit's, it's so easy, it's so stupid that people overcomplicate it. I really laugh at the foreign exchange market in the game because of just the fuck shit that goes on. To me, it's the funniest thing in the world, but you know, I actually enjoy the comedy. I think it's comedy. You know, I think it's comedy. But nah, price should continue going up. Um, you're probably like, no, that cup in the handle is not real. Watch this though. Watch this. I'm gonna show you some shit, right? I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you. How, I'm gonna show you a cheat code to this whole game. Watch this. Forex, forex, cheat, cheat, cheat. No, that you can't say this isn't. Hold on. Wait a minute. Oh, oh. Wait. They got divergence. What are you? Which one of your forex traders teaches uh divergence? Let me show you how to get his shit for free. Fibonacci. Anybody teach Fibonacci with a moving average? Uh, give you that shit for free. Uh, what is this? A PDF? You know, you know what I'm saying? You know, go ahead and look. Okay, whoa, this is so they got all type of stuff on here. This is crazy. It, divergence cheat sheet. This thing actually tells you how to trade, bro. Did you guys know that this was on Google? Did anybody know if this was on Google? Anybody? Nah. Okay, well, I mean, that's the code to Google. You type in Forex cheat sheet and they give you this. And you, you might say, oh, well, how do I read it? Um, Well, it kind of tells you, you know, like if you're confused, what you could do is turn your charts, right? Like if this shit confuses you, fuck it. Like oh, I can't see anything. Literally turn your charts, right? into fucking lines like this. <laughs> and then you go to the cheat sheet, right? And then like, oh, well, now it makes sense. It's much easier to read. So make it simple for yourself. Make it simple for yourself. You know what I mean? Make it simple for yourself. All right, but I'll go ahead and show you that cup with handle uh, pattern and all of that. You know what I'm saying? So go ahead and pull up this shit right here. So here's inverted cup with handle. This is the top one. It was inverted cup with handle. The one I showed you was a, a bullish cup with handle. It was actual cup with handle. So um, I'll show you shit. Here's it's all right here. I, it's all right here. You know what I mean? Like this forex information is out here. You're just lazy. I know you don't want to hear it. But I mean, it is what it is. This kind, of, this cheat sheet is uh, distorted and stuff. But I mean, you can go here and just type it in. Like even if you wanted to type in a uh, forex cup, with, not because I'm gonna have people on here who troll. So I, I just I troll back. 
by just showing you that it's really like right here right like it's really right here so this is the cup and handle you know you see this they draw cups on here too <laughs> you know what i mean so it's it's funny you know what i mean and the, here's the inverted one that's a little bit different you know what i mean so but this is the cup and handle that's how it is so you guys can uh do it how you want feel me here it is again you know you learn something new every time you get to the stream and uh let's get it you said put the no uh, tell me to freestyle on all right i'm gonna put that shit on while we move to uh call out a pair call out a pair and we're gonna get it cracking call out a pair and we're gonna get it cracking all right he said dead ass i'll just be getting my back and when they try to dictate motherfuckers trying to find a way that you spend time speculating our moves could have put that time into planning out i'm already knowing bro you feel me i'm already knowing he said, I already got the no hotel me this uh, shit freestyle in my playlist. I'm going to bang that shit at the end of the stream where I'll bang it right now. You guys call out the next pair that you uh, want me to check out. You know what I'm saying? And I'm going to bang that no hotel me this freestyle. And we're going to get it cracking like that. Man, y'all be over here lit. Let's see. You cat. Okay. I could do you cat. I could do you cat. All right, so I'm gonna bang that uh, Noah tell me to freestyle. Well, then now I can't bang that one on this stream because of the beat, and then they'll be on some bullshit, so. Hey, you know who the funniest forks nigga in the world is? That school of genius dude. Oh my God, though, in the last 30 days, bro probably made like $90 million. Nigga, is, do Warren Buffett got an investing course or some shit that we can purchase or some shit? Like, bro, I'm gonna tell you the truth. I'm just about to call a fucking a frog a frog because I see what it is. But this nigga been, the first video he took of mine, bro been over at my page so much. The first video he took of mine was the uh, the understand the Japanese candlestick video. All bro did was strip this shit down and literally verbatim copied the fucking title verbatim. I'm like, bro, that is so stupid, bro. And I just been watching dude just, you know what I'm saying? Dude, whatever he does, now he's fucking losing his, like the thing is once you start being fake, you got to keep that fake shit up. You know what I mean? That's why I really be over the whole Forex YouTube shit because I'm like, like, bro, I'm really not gonna do what you niggas do. I don't wanna keep flipping small accounts. I don't, no, fuck that shit, it's fun. You feel me, show you guys this is what you do, but bro, why the fuck am I gonna really be on here flipping for small accounts? Like, I'm not doing that shit, you know what I'm saying? Like, we living, we making shit happen. You wanna see me come to the streets, bro? I'm, stay outside, you feel me? So, uh, that's what that shit is. But that fake shit, come on now. Bro, bro latest title was how I made $971, 32, uh, 971,000, $325 um, trading Forex on gold. First off, all right, bro. But if y'all y'all want to keep believing the, uh, the hype, I mean, you know, it is what it is. But I feel like and know that most of the Forex shit is fake. I've seen niggas fake withdrawals. I've seen niggas fake everything. One of my homies came to the Discord, recorded some shit. He showed me with the FTMO challenge, how niggas is doing the FTMO shit to pawn off the accounts like they real and shit too. So it's a lot of a lot of fuckery. We, we be talking about it over on Twitch and everything too. You know what I mean? He said, Play, please stop selling out. I'm gonna play the NoHo, uh, NoHo Tell Meetings uh, freestyle. And then I need you guys to call out a, uh, a pair. Well, you already been calling out pairs. You said UCAT, so I'm gonna go to UCAT. Feel me? A lot of, but a lot of what you see in the forest industry, man, stems from. I feel like I created a lot of food roots. You know what I mean? Um, sad that these niggas really don't like, but that's how they get their bread, bro. They don't. Some people really got a love and a passion for the for the charts and for the game and for you know the investing world. And some people are just scavengers, bro. They're fucking leeches. They come, they see an opportunity, and it's like the opportunists. You know what I'm saying? Like not to say that they do this forex shit, but you know. All right, so this was you, cat. You probably asked like like the thing is this was on Twitch. So I haven't fucked with this chart since the last time we were on Twitch. So as you see, like everything kind of plays out, you know, just what it is. Like, I don't know why that's the market, bro, but that's just what it does. So what am I gonna do? I'm, am I gonna fuck with this? I'm not. Only thing I'll do is remove this and explain where we're at. So I'll explain where we're at. Boom. Price comes up a little bit. Okay. This is gonna turn out being a, some type of harmonic pattern or some shit. I know, I remember niggas was mad when I was doing the harmonics every day because y'all couldn't understand it, but give a fuck. 
feel me? Possibly, you know, I don't know if it's going to come to 134. I don't know if it's coming. With, I feel like it's going to stay in the 132, maybe get to 133 for a retest. That's like 40 pips away. So maybe hit 133 for a retest. You feel me? Retest that 133 and then just drop back down to the downside and continue on this bearish trend. You feel me? So that's what this is. Am I going to leave it? I'm going to leave it exactly what it is. We can go to the daily. Here's the four hour. That's what you see. So. I mean, you can pretty much play that by ear. Is it going to retrace a little bit to the downside? It will. But then continue. You should push up bulls and then go, uh, then go bears. I feel like every most of these Forex niggas is fake, bro. That's just what it is. Like I said, let me look my history up. You feel me? Go to the Discord. Niggas be on that fake shit. You feel me? I do. It is some, it is some, real, uh, it is some real traders in here, though. But it's just like a majority, though. Like, I don't know what it is about the whole course shit. Like, that shit is crazy to me, bro. Like, niggas be pressing that shit. Like, like okay, bro, I understand. But thing is, I feel like you wouldn't press that if you didn't go get all those leases, you know what I mean, and get the high-ass fucking bills. Like, nobody told you to go get all them bills. Nobody. You wanna, you trying to live above your means, bro. Just chill. You know what I mean? No hotel media freestyle. Let's get that shit. Then I'm about to, uh, well, we already explained you, cat. So I guess I'll go explain uh, US dollar Swiss franc next. Well, I can't play that shit because the beat. I forgot. Good thing I didn't play that because the beat. I can play it on Twitch, though. YouTube be fucking your shit up once it is. Like, once it's, yeah, because it's, yeah. I'll play Rose Royce Energy, though. I'm about to go to US, uh, US Swiss Franc right now. Woo! Shit. Top feels so much better than the bottom, baby. So Show niggas how I'm living, you shit. know what I'm saying? From the hood, baby. Uh -huh. Young and paying with a maid. Fuck it. Woo! Uh, it's that lifestyle difference, you see the difference, nigga Everybody listen, I tell them listen, nigga Now we off that full Rex, we own it I don't trap, I trade, baby, I'm on uh, Look, so let's really talk, give a dance uh, the big dogs move the mortars in. Look, Forex living, ooh, Forex moving. Uh, ETX stocks, baby, all inclusive. Uh, REITs, bitch, I'm really a mix. Niggas mad that I'm black and move stocks like bricks. On the same thing as Buffett, I found some monthlies that hit. Found some annual flips and some quarterly kicks. Moving cake like packs. Oh, okay, the grass is greener where you water it. So I watered it. Had to get my crypto miners busted, then I followed it. Got I'm a I sat on a pair and then I'm targeting Lock it in, profit margin set Then I talk my shit and now I'm barging in Forks on my face, better take that trip with what the charges is Like and see us spreads a kill a lot before the targets hit If money's in the market, then it's working less than dollars Been flexing, I remember trading Brexit Championship balling like I'm Wayne Gretzky Stressless, diamonds should be so impressive But under stress, I see some diamonds crumble under pressure A lot of violence and crime, a lot of people in strife a lot of roads so baby, a lot of roads go baby I mean they callin' it crazy, I mean I'm tired of them there They like the way that I'm wavy, and that's the life of the trade uh, If the bubbles up the left and let them know Let the motherfucking bass just roll Bitch, uh, uh, uh The equity up and you know it's gon' flow Niggas talking but we still on the go Bitch Oh yeah Yeah, man, please, please stop selling now. Goddamn, they got enough. Please stop selling now. 
All right, we're gonna get back in now. Please stop selling out on the on the next uh, pair on the next pair. But uh, let's get it. He said let that last song rock. We got it, bro. I got it, bro. I got hella songs on here, man. Just if you guys want to rock with the songs, come fuck with me on uh, on Spotify, on Apple Music. Really, I want the YouTube music shit to turn up. So um, really, you guys just bang the songs. Like I said, if any of the songs hit 100k, you know what I'm saying. Then for sure, for sure, we dropping all the courses and it's a wrap. So y'all just running shits up to 100k and uh, get it cracking like that. So. Price was in a range, okay? And that's what I got this arrow over here I'm about to show you. So price was in a range. And what I mean is it wasn't breaking this range. As you see, it was solid. It kind of come up to this $1 and then drop down to this 96 cent, you know what I'm saying? Or 95 cents. So shoot up to a dollar, drop down to 95 cent. Shoot up to a dollar, drop down to 95 cent or 96 cent. Shoot up to a dollar, drop down to 95 cent, 96 cent. And then once it broke under that whole 95 and in the structure and it got to 94, it just starts selling up. So now it's out of this range. Okay, it's out of this range. Park is, park it. Market's out of here. Okay, now we're turning. Boom. Okay. And now this is the range we're in. So this is the part we're in. So you're no longer trying to play the up and down game. Now you're just, you know, looking for shorter opportunities. Okay. As the market just continues to slide through here. Now, somebody was trolling. I was like, what can stop it? Uh, and they were like, anything. And yeah, anything can stop it. But the funny part is, is like, I'm on this side laughing at you because you really just don't understand how simple this shit is. Trying to figure this shit out. So what you could do, to be honest, is sit back, receive the information, right? You feel me? If you don't like me, I don't give a fuck, nigga. A lot of niggas don't like me. But what I want you to do is receive this information. I don't give a fuck. Like, I'm just a vessel that's pushing it. You know what I mean? I'm just a vessel that's pushing it. Pick up the info. Is it going to be raw? It's going to be raw like sushi. You know what I'm saying? Raw like a fart. That's what it's going to be. You know what I mean? But that's what it is. So let's get it. So look, price was in a range. Okay, now it's trending to the downside. Price should continue selling off until we get a major correction. Now, when it's a sell-off, Hell yeah, it's gonna keep selling, keep selling, keep selling, keep selling until we get that correction. So I feel like a correction is near, but is it coming anytime soon? Possibly not, okay? We may do a week of green or two weeks of green, and you feel me, or trying to doji out green and then drop. But these are these are the weeklies, and every weekly, shit, for the past, what, since May, you feel me, have just been fucking red. So this market's a bear market, a very strong bear, uh, bear market, you feel me? He said, if I want to help people open a trading fund, nah, I'm doing what I'm doing right here. You feel me? So how about you go do that shit? I'm tired of you niggas suggesting, telling me what the fuck to do. Nobody told me what to do and they haven't. You know what I'm saying? I've been doing whatever the fuck I've been wanting to do for the longest and that's what it's always been. But let me tell you something. If you feel like you got ideas to imp improve your community, then you can go do whatever you got to do. But what I'm going to do is keep doing what I'm going to do. And that's what it is. You're not going to get me to do what I don't want to do. Now, you could go do whatever you would like to do, and I encourage you to do it. You feel me? How you feel about that? How you feel about that, uh, that response? Let me know how you feel about that in the chat. Anyway, so let's get it. You know, I got to deal with the fucking trolls because they get on here. These niggas is idiots, bro. They get on here. They just, they like being attention whores. They like being seen. So we respond to them and shit. You know what I'm saying? Turn up with him one time. I like responding to him because really it's funny to me. You know what I'm saying? But that's what it is. So this is you, uh, this is uh, you Swiss. <laughs> this is you cat, I mean, not you cat, uh, United, uh, United States. See, that's when I be smoking that good grain. US dollar Swiss franc. Look at him stumbling on those words. He, fuck can he trade? And he's over here stuttering. What is this shit? What is this? It must be a fake. Where's his fucking track record? Sky, nobody should sign up to that shit. Nobody should even get the free course, you know? Nobody should even join the fucking Discord. You should come buy my shit for, uh, you know, seven ninety nine ninety nine. 99 After you buy that one, after you buy that program, you know, you can't get the, you gotta go through the folks program before you go to the next program. So you gotta come buy the next program. That's just gonna be two thousand nine hundred ninety nine ninety nine ninety nine ninety nine. 99 99 And the only thing we're gonna learn in there is, you know, I'm gonna confuse you with some shit, you know what I'm saying? And, you know, by the time you're done with this shit and you feel like you're extremely informed, Let's get it. Silver. We could do silver before we get up out of here. Um, I want to do one more currency pair and then I'll do silver. So let's do one more currency pair and then I'll do silver and then Bitcoin and then I'm uh, getting it cracking. And say, yeah, I want to see a trader's track record. I feel like that's dope if they invest in money for you. But most people who trade Forex, they don't care about you, bro. Most people are charging you thousands for this information so they can give a damn about showing you shit because it's fuck you have a nice day.
think about it. Why would I care about your opinion, right? If I could get in the market and make money, whether you like me, whether you don't like me, whether I'm tall, whether I'm short, whether I'm buff, whether I'm skinny, like it doesn't matter. So then it makes it kind of like, I don't need you in a sense, like to go eat now. So I got a whole different type of freedom, you know what I mean? Cause I can get into this little cell phone, you know what I'm saying? And get shit cracking. So it's like, that's why, I've, that's why I like Forex for the simple fact that it's like, oh, well, Tyler, you should do this. Well, no, but then I can get in the market and go make my bread without you fucking with me. And I've been doing it, you know what I mean? So if you really want that freedom to be able to tell people, no, if you really want that, it's a superpower to be able to get this bread, you know what I'm saying, without, um, it's a superpower having to, uh, being able to get this bread without having to either A, show up to work, without having to B, stress about it, you know what I'm saying, without having to C, deal with people. Like, this is the most stress-free income making opportunity in the world, you know what I'm saying? Like, you literally don't have to deal with people. People are like, yeah, I feel like this. Give a fuck what you feel, nigga. You came over here with your feelings. <laughs> Weird ass, get out your feelings, man. How do I get the charts to look that clear? I don't know, I just make them small, like, I zoom it down, you know, I zoom my charts down so I could be able to see. That's why I like the trading view, because like on MetaTrader, you can't make your charts super tiny and finite. But over here, I can make it so finite that it's just a little baby line. You know what I mean? But nah, we on this last pair though. Let's get it. Let me see. We on this last pair. All right. Um, New Zealand. Okay, I'll fuck with New Zealand with you. I'll, I'll fuck with New Zealand. You feel me? I fuck with uh, New Zealand. 100. Hey, we're going to turn up too. I got one more track. I'm going to let that Please Stop Selling Out track bang because I feel like people need to really hear that song. So whatever you do, please stop selling out. All right. So this was on Twitch. We talked about textbooks, bullish flag. We talked about shit breaking out. I mean, we talk about all this shit on Twitch. So this same bullish flag is what you've seen on another pair as well, but this was old. So I'm about to go ahead and uh, erase that. And then uh, we're gonna get cracking on this New Zealand. I'll mark it up while I let that please stop selling out bang in the background. Please stop selling out. Oh yeah, oh yeah. The song is telling you, you should have came correct when you had control first. But I'm gonna let you listen to that shit one more line. I mean, one more line. <laughs> one more time. Just sit there and you listen. Fingerprinter, if you need a fingerprinter. Hold on, I got you. Just one second. I want you to hear this shit because I, I really talk to my shit in this. Like. But announced king shit. If it's just the day I planned it out. Commander in chief, command it plays through the south. I'm talking continent, say yourself from the doubt. We own a bigger cheese, what you see, shut your mouth. The operation room is two subs, keep it loud. Call the banks up, we need safe parents. Got the fingerprinter if you need a fingerprint. Bring the heights in history and you can't get near us. We control the money, you just sit there and you listen. We in the next phase, so fuck if you hurt. Should've got correct when you're at control first. Niggas act tough, but my niggas really tough 
us, yo We don't want problems and you really don't want those And we be scaling buildings so we catch all your black soaps Black snow suits, black over and black gold Time up for scope and throw them all through the back door Need the ancient secrets, it's a heist for the black holes And if they don't add me up, you gon' have to bust that note We don't all right, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. So that was Please Stop Selling Out, man. I was that West Coast Long Beach vibe, you know what I'm saying? So if you guys know about that Long Beach shit, man, that's definitely that vibe right there, man. We definitely took it back to the West for that. Let's get it. So let's get it. So price shows a downward channel, right? Shows a downward channel, meaning, yeah, it looks like it's descending. Okay, so for the past three weeks, we have had three weeks of red. No true gains in New Zealand. Um, now, uh, pound was gaining. Um, shit, all type of other joints was were gaining. But, I mean, shit, just this New Zealand seemed like it hasn't really been posting gains like uh, like the other pairs. Now, usually once one pair goes up, they usually all go up. Okay, um, but not every single one. Now, there's strong correlations, but sometimes it's not always there. Although, look, possible retest, then try to push up to the upside with the indexes, okay? And this is what it is. You see price pretty much come down to retest this zone, came down, retested this zone, so that's where it's at now. It did come down for the retest, so it broke out, boom, it broke out, came down to retest, so if it breaks back through, okay, we gotta be like, all right, fuck it. But I've looked at the indexes, I looked at shit, pretty much all the other uh, currency pairs and stuff like that. This was March 30th, or March 30th, this was uh, March 23rd, uh, 2020, so this was back in March, so price has been rising, you know, price has been rising. This is when the whole coronavirus crash is right here. Mind you, I'm on a weekly, so this was the whole coronavirus shit. I don't know what the fuck this is. Some bullshit. Get off my charts, nigga. Um, but, uh, this was the whole coronavirus shit right here when everything really popped off and then i mean price has been pushing up so if you've seen in the indexes you know what i'm saying we're also in that blunt pattern as well you know what i'm saying we're in that blunt pattern as well so i mean that means price is gonna get high nigga. <laughs> you feel me that's gonna be funny but nah definitely um you guys man you say you bought you you're about to have me binge listen to all your songs to get the nuggets yo appreciate that appreciate that Let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. I'm about to make that shit pop. But boom, we got that retest. Okay, boom, retest. And then price should go ahead and continue pushing to the upside. I know it's showing red. Um, usually, sometimes, I mean, in the stock market, a lot of people will tell you to buy on the red days, all right? Now, it, like I said, I'm giving you a lot of little game and stuff like that. Um, and that's just what it is. So you definitely want to try to buy on the red days, you know what I mean? A lot of people getting those courses right now. Um, looking at the joint on the back, you feel me? I keep getting notifications and shit, so you guys keep rocking, keep rocking. Y'all on there running up, you feel me? Y'all on there turning that shit up, so let's get it, man. Soon we're gonna have fucking a uh, hundred thousand, a uh, hundred thousand of those trade game courses downloaded into multiple phones, multiple computers, multiple systems. Like, the course is gonna be pretty dope, it's pretty fire, you know, and it's free. For the F, though, for the F, though, you feel me? Um, they all got video links that link back to everything so you guys will be able to uh, to get it cracking. It was dope. It was in collaboration with Baby Pips. So shout out Baby Pips, man. Make sure you go to babypips.com and get that info. Get it! So let's get it. He said, y'all the goat. Nah, y'all the goat, bro. He said, y'all lucky to miss not here. Yeah, she downstairs cooking right now, but for sure, for sure, you know her block game's stupid. <laughs> Let's get it. So that's what I see right here with this weekly. Now I'm about to go from the weekly to the daily. Boom, and you see we're in that zone. So we are we are in that zone, in that retest zone. Um, could we keep pushing to the sound? downside? It's a possibility. We may see a little, another bear day. Um, strong possibility. But then I feel like the bulls are really going to take over. I'm looking at the indexes. I know they got to drop before they rise. You know, so I just, boom, drop before the rise. You know, that's all I'm expecting. If this drops, it would come down to, what is that, 65.4 right now. Price will probably come down to like 64, um, 60, 64.9 or like 64.8. You feel me? Something like that. And then start pushing back up. Here's a four hour. So it is trying to make those lower lows, you know, but I mean, I feel like price is going to hold just because this is a strong retest area and it retested that zone after it broke out of a channel on the weekly. So boom, break and then retest. Usually a lot of people try to enter at the retest, you know what I'm saying? So that's a way to do it like that. Now, let's get it. Let's get it. Now I'm about to go ahead and... uh I'm gonna play that Forex drill. And while, while I'm playing that, I'm gonna go ahead and mark up Bitcoin, give you what I think about that, and then we're gonna get up out of this bitch for the day. You know what I'm saying? So let's get it. And you probably like, why do you put Forex drill? Like, you'll see. <laughs> you'll see. 
it's too fucking popping. I even like the, uh, to be honest, like I like the cover art, man. The cover art smack on the YouTube, bro. So shout out to Sin for the cover art, bro. Went stupid on this shit. I just had to make it like 1080p. He gave me the um the 1080 1080 version, so it was a square. It's the square that you see. I had to make it 1920 1080p for the YouTube thumbnail. But definitely, man. Shout out to the squad, man. I know I got a lot of people that that fuck with me, man. So shout out to Trey Gang. Trey Gang. The motherfucking motherfucking motto, you know what it is. I'm about to bang that forest drill, and then like I said, we about to go over to um to Bitcoin, and then let's get it cracking like that. You feel me? Somebody said, bro, may I ask you why the fuck you live streaming and the market's not even open yet? Twitch, 8 a.m. to 10 p.m. I mean 10 p.m. to uh, 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. You definitely could tap in with me. Um, I don't mind talking markets. I do it shit Monday through Friday, so. It doesn't really matter. Like I said, bro, like I'm I'm unaffected by trolls. Why am I streaming when the market's not open? Because I am. Why are you on here watching? Because it's entertaining. You ask dumbass questions. That's why you're living a dumbass life. You know what I mean? Get your mind together. Get your let's 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 do some mindset training right now. I will not ask Tyler no dumbass questions because I don't want my life to be on no dumbass shit. I really want to be wealthy, so I'm gonna align myself and mentally ask when I do speak because the tongue is powerful. I'm gonna make sure no fucking idiotic shit comes out of my mouth for the simple fact that I know that my tongue is powerful. So what I speak, I attract. So what I want to speak is positive thoughts. What I want to do is attract. I want to attract income. So you need to start talking money. That's what, that's what should be coming out of your mouth money not no negativity money need to come out your mouth every time you open your mouth if it ain't about the money then shut the fuck up what's good what you got to say about that okay now listen to this track fuck you talking about why he like that nigga because none of y'all gave me this shit i had to get out there and get it It's like the best of both worlds. Tell you you're not. <laughs> you know the vibes. You know the vibes. Trey gang shit. Let's get it. Let's get it. So that's that forex drill, man. Um, shit. A lot of y'all are vibing with that. I looked at some of the comments. Like people are like, "Yo, please give me the lyrics and stuff like that." Somebody said they thought it was a strategy. Damn, you guys are spamming to um make my songs in 432 hertz. Okay, I definitely could do that again. Somebody said, why am I trying to sound like I'm from the UK? Well, because the UK drill, that's where it comes from. Like, that's why it was called Forex drill. Like, you kind of got to adapt, like Forex drill. Like, you know what I mean? So, and then also I feel like it was because, uh, shit, like, 
He said drill and forks are two different things. Don't try to combine them. Well, I've already combined them. Now what? I didn't try. I did it. So you stop trying. You know what I'm saying? And maybe that's why you're not where you want to be in life. You tried too much. If you just did it. And what did Yoda say? Do. Not try. And it's like, what do you mean? Do. Do. With a period. And then not try. You feel me? Like, do it. So. I... I'm sorry that you don't have that motherfucking bull in you, man. You know, you don't got that dog in you. Like, you gotta get that beast. You gotta develop that shit. You need to go. What you need to do is get off my stream and go in a, uh, to a mirror, uh, to a motherfucking bathroom in a mirror and give yourself one of those, I am the best fox trader in the world uh, conversations. You know what I'm saying? Get you pumped up or some shit. But you asking me what this is and what I see. So all I did was just, I mean, you know the whole, you know the whole shit, you know? You know what the uptrend is. Um, price for Bitcoin has been on the up and up, you know what I mean? So really, I'm just, you know, showing you guys shit to up and up, just up and up, you know, just up and up, boom, boom, boom. So you know what a fucking uptrend is. It was cool. I mean, shit, that's called something too. But I mean, if you go to the course, then um, you definitely will be able to see, um, you know, you get definitely be able to see inside. You know, and see exactly what this is. And you'd be like, damn, this is all it was the whole time? And yeah. All right. So Bitcoin, like I said, I feel like we're going to drop before we rise. All right. Go ahead and delete this off and put my old markup up. I don't know if it's even going to let me. Fuck it. I'll make a new one. All right. So I feel like this is the accumulation phase that we're at right now. Um, price just keeps hovering around this 12K. All right. The demand zone is strong. So here's the strong guys demand right here. I'm gonna show you where that's at. All right, so 10.9 is the strong guys demand zone. I don't know if it's gonna come back there, obviously. But like 10.9 between or between 10.8 uh, and 11, 149, that's where these candlesticks are, are hitting. So could Bitcoin slip like that? Bitcoin has to be dumping. That shit don't get no fucks, you feel me? It could. So it's resistance is right here or the supply is right here in the sense like we're at that strong resistance right now not breaking through. So I mean, if you know what supporting is, it resistance is, I know um, the confusing mentors, right? They'll tell you, Ty, do you use trend line trading method or just supply and demand? Bro, supply and demand is supporting resistance. So um, I use both and that's why I have a resistance on top and then a demand zone or a motherfucking square box nigga a square box on the bottom of my charts this is a demand zone <laughs> niggas just confuse you man you feel me I, whichever way whichever way you want to do it whichever way you want to do it you feel me yeah, and they ain't here timing out the mods in here timing niggas out <laughs> He said, nah, they need a 3 a.m. Ocean Sky motivation uh, rant. Hey, remember, remember, uh, remember motiv uh, Ocean Sky motivation? Bro used to be going hard, bro. Bro used to be going hard. Let's get it. So this is what I see with Bitcoin. I feel like it's going to drop down. What is this? So if it does slip, then okay, boom, we come into that 11, 149. But I feel like Bitcoin really is going to come and retest this 11, 383. You feel me? And then try to continue up or just stay in this range of 11.9 and fucking 10.9. It's a little thousand uh, dollar range between there. It's really just been ranging. So that's the flag that we're, we're at right now. So in a sense, we're at a bullish flag. So this is what's going on. Boom. And then boom. Boom. That's what's going on right now. That's this right here. It just looked a little bit different. After it breaks out and it goes about 13,000, the next part of that is to go up. Boom. And then it'll go into that little phase again. Boom. Shit simple, bro. Boom. And then what goes up? Boom. So this is called, uh, nigga, welcome to the pyramids, man. This is it's the motherfucking pyramids right here. You feel me? So I don't know who wants to, uh, like I said, you, you can uh, do what you do, but shit simple right here. So that's my markup. We're gonna go out with a bang today, man. We're gonna drop that, uh, what song should we drop on the, on the outro? What song should we drop to the outro? Give me a title in there song to drop on the outro. Let's party on the way out, man. Let's party on the way out. If you haven't already, TreyGang.com. Make sure you follow all of my uh, socials. Make sure you so follow all of my socials, man. Make sure you follow all of my socials. You say it looks like a sending wedge, for sure, for sure. Hell yeah, Bryce, I know you be on it, bro. I know you be on it. You feel me? I know bro be on it. Um, I'll probably be, uh, I don't know, I might stream Fortnite or something on Twitch. I know we about to be on GTA. Uh, I got my boy, he's uh, like 
I don't play GTA without a mod menu on PC for the simple fact that, nigga, the PC world is way different than consoles. Like, on PC, bro, like, everybody has mods, bro. Like, it's just, it's no way around it. They will fuck your game up. And if they hear you streaming or you streaming, then it just, it's just, it's so stupid. So, you always want to protect yourself online, you know what I mean? So, that's that's what it is. So, let's get it. So, people say raising the stakes, Rose Race Energy, Trade or Die. Let's get it. Nas 100. Okay. Let's see what song we going out to. Forex, Forex lifestyle. Okay. Say a trade game. You learn, you learn this by yourself at twelve. Let's get it. Rose Race Energy. If it's not about a stock, he said Mary respect Ty dropping nuggets for free. I fuck with y'all, bro. I rock with y'all. All I ask is y'all run my shit up. You almost got my my songs. You know the twenty thousand a pop. You know what I'm saying. So we on the way up. What do you want, Ty? Then you run the streams up, bro. I'm good, B. Like, what are you getting from this, Ty? I don't know. Go check my YouTube stats on Social Blade. See how much they paying me for this shit, which is little to fucking nothing. Especially not, nigga, what the value is. You know what I mean? Uh, uh, yeah, you trying to find some shit. Let me, let me show you what you can find. This dick. Get the fuck out of here. He said, what's the secret of Warren Buffett? Warren Buffett is lit. Shit, that's, that's bro secret. Bro secret is buy and may and go away. You feel me? All right, and we're going to bang that new world plan on the way out. We're going to bang that new world plan on the way out. Let's get it. We're going to bang that new world plan on the way out. Let's get it. Shout out to all y'all, though, man. Make sure you subscribe to all my socials if you haven't already. If you have any questions, you can ask those, too. I'm gonna answer, I will be answering those questions while I pull up that new world plan. All right, I'll be answering those questions while I pull up that new world plan. So if you got any questions, definitely uh, let's get it cracking. All right. Cash money, Chop! One time. I'ma close it properly, bro. I got you. I got you. Room, I make these boys a stain on the wall. If the bank is in the field, they gon' have to. And yeah, I did hear about Warren Buffett and uh and his gold investment. We will speak about that tomorrow on the Twitch. So I'll put my Twitch on the description uh right here so you guys can follow the socials and shit too. We will be talking about a lot this week though on Twitch, so make sure you tune in. Basically, Twitch is this shit, but every single day. Hold on, and let me answer to this be, comp, be humble shit. Somebody said, don't forget, I, I shouldn't forget where I came from. Nigga, I'm screaming West Side, Long Beach, everywhere the fuck I go. I ain't never forgot where I came from. But you gotta think, nigga, you didn't give me this shit. I really had to grind for this. So, oh, you could be back there, but I'm not going back there, though. But I'm not going back there. You know what I mean? And that's the thing. You're gonna stay where you're at because you're, held, you're holding all of that weight on your soldiers. You gotta be proud of people's success and let that shit go. Now, when I be roasting niggas because they selling courses and shit, like, I have fun roasting niggas on some wild and out style shit, like, because it's fun. But at the end of the day, to get with it, you gotta shake that shit off. You gotta shake it off. I won't be as humble as you expect me to be because I'm not you. You're your own person. Maybe you'll be fucking humble or what you consider humble, but I'm about to be out there. Yeah, this is what it is and get shit cracking because I need people to see the fucking real and that's what it's gonna be. So me being humble is me literally not shitting on you every single day. You know what I'm saying? Me over here giving you this free information, that's me being humble. I could be charging you thousands for this shit. Like, man, fuck these people, nigga. Like, what? But I'm fucking with you. You feel me? So that's me being humble. Now you go be humble and let me finish banging this track. You dick! I know niggas with the keys to the city And I'm talking about the skis and you still looking silly We making power moves and power players moving with me They understand investments and we understand it dearly Speak the same language and they can't get near me And I'm getting near a level they'll either love me or they'll fear me Money comes with power we control the markets clearly And I make any stock pop if I mention it yearly But again the mention show me some returns on the bag And if the bag don't got the returns we be turning your ass I know now I'm on the road, so it's out of yours. I know the bitches thought they chokes, but it's out of yours. I know snakes that fuck with snakes for the quite at all. If this is snake, then this is snake, and I'm out the room. I know now I'm on the road, so it's out of yours. I know the bitches thought they chokes, but it's out of yours. I know snakes that fuck with snakes for the quite at all. And this song was so true. I know snakes that fuck with snakes, you feel me, for the bread. That's what that word mean, for, for the bread, bro. So it's like, Niggas will be in cahoots with each other for the bread. And I'm telling you in a song, like, we not on that. Like, if I don't like you, I'm not gonna work with you for money, bro. What? If this is snake, then this is snake, then I'm out the room. Look, never talk shit, gold clips on gold clips. If you know we sell the chips, then why I ask about the dip? See, niggas asking questions, sometimes questions get you killed. Better learn street code, even suits can get clipped. If you're suited, niggas probably think 
shaking, rooted. Get hit for being sneaky or mistaken for the ops. Plead a fifth like Iron Mike. Fibonacci blasting off the iron lights. My iron nice. Iron looking like I just took a shipment, made it bright. Shipments on top of shipments, we are shipping off the ice. I've been working for this position, positioned in the life. And I've been. I've been working for this position, positioned in the life. Busted about computers since a kid, and now I'm busting mother boards for the rigs. We on another level in the music for the kids. You're not fucking with me, I am scientifically advanced. Geographical maps, demographic for the facts. Running up with some of the profit, and we tally up the NAN. And yo, we need more, uh, we need like eight more subs to get to 73,000. So if you guys watching and you haven't subbed yet, make sure you hit that sub button. Make sure you hit that sub button. I'm gonna answer some questions too. Somebody said, what time frames do I like entering? I like entering on an hour. Sometimes I like entering on a five minute. Sometimes I like entering on a 15. I know my returns before I even touch down in the plan. And if the money ain't right, run the numbers again. I only know business, that's what. You said market closed for a hoodie? Damn, y'all already on the next week drop. But yeah, and then um, it got shit on the sleeves and stuff too. So the market closed hoodie is dope. Um, damn, the, the the shirt is in the music video that I just did, but the hoodie is dope. It got the shit on the sleeves. It's like, it's dope as fuck. So, I mean, but somebody's already on it. I don't know if y'all leaked it already. I know niggas be leaking my shit, so. <laughs> yeah. I can comprehend prodigy, new retirement, my new wealth plans. I know now I'm on the road, so it's adios. I know bitches thought they chose, but it's adios. I know six that You said try to find my spiritual balance, bro. My spiritual balance, like, let me tell you the truth about my spiritual balance. I wake up, I do whatever the fuck I want to do. Um, like, you guys be hella pressed. You got to believe, you got to think about it like this. Like, I respond back to your comments, like, on Twitch. I mean, not on Twitch, but on here, because you're talking to me right now. But, like, in person, like, if you just say some dumb shit, like, bro, Honestly, I wouldn't even look at you and I'm not looking your way. You know what I mean? Like, I'm not looking your way. You got nothing going on that I feel like, I mean, I should even be interested in. And if you did, then it'll be across my table. I deal with a lot of people who got a lot of shit going on. So um, I'm probably as humble as it come. Do I respond back to trolls for the fuck of it? Like, why not? Look at the voice that I'm responding to you with. Am I yelling am I, or am I just like speaking, bro? Like solid you know what i mean but um we're gonna let this shit bang and then we're gonna end the we're gonna end the stream and we're gonna be off this bitch you feel me let's get that's that nigga now i'm on the road so it's adios <laughs> I know them bitches thought they chose, but it's adios. Yeah. Uh-huh. I know niggas that fuck with niggas for the money. And if it's a snake, then it's a snake. I will not be in that room. Protecting my energy. Shout out to everybody who vibe with me today. Man, have a blessed Sunday. Have a blessed Sunday. Have a blessed week. I want you guys to really, you know what I'm saying, just like use this shit to change your life. This shit changed my life. That's the reason I got the forest tat on my face. Like, I wanted people to see it. Nigga, what changed your life? Boom. Sitting big as fuck. You know what I'm saying? Pull up. What changed your life? Boom. Mike. So let's get it. I got y'all up, man. It's your boy Ty, and I'm signing off this bitch. Make sure you tap into all my socials. Make sure you tap into the Discord if you want to tap in with the community. Make sure you tap into the Twitch. You basically get this experience every single day for two hours, Monday through Friday. And uh, make sure you go cop some merch and go get them free courses from TradeGain.com. And now uh, it's your boy Ty, and I'm out this bitch. TradeGain! Fuck you talking about. Just get it.